Welcome to Fanfiction Audiobook. Dragon Ball. Domination of the Universe. Chapter 1. When Su Fan woke up, he found a graceful girl lying beside him, with a faint fragrance on her body. Su Fan rubbed his eyes vigorously, like a dream. Because the girl was facing away from Su Fan, Su Fan didn't know what she looked like. However, when Su Fan got up and saw himself in the mirror, he was suddenly surprised and delighted, and his expression was complicated. Leping. This is a special time crossing over Leping's body. Happily, I, a Dragon Ball fan, have finally come to the world of Dragon Ball. Shocked, for Mao is Leping, this weak chicken. Leping can be said to be the weakest existence among the warriors of the Dragon Ball world. I don't want to be Leping. I'm going to be a Saiyan. Su Fan was a little sore. Since I am Leping, then this girl is. It must be Bulma. Su Fan held his breath and gently turned the girl's body over. The girl's beautiful face was facing Su Fan. Sure enough, it was Bulma. Congratulations on activating the super download system. Just when Su Fan's hand made contact with Bulma's body, a line of text appeared in Su Fan's sea of knowledge. Immediately after, the text continued to emerge. Bulma's technology, 50M. Current cellular data, 2G. Current download speed, 15 to 20 KS. Reputation value, 0. There is also a note after the reputation value. Reputation value can upgrade mobile data and exchange download data. B. Do you want to download Bulma technology? At this time, such a line of text appeared in Su Fan's sea of knowledge. And after this line of text, there is also a yes and a no option. What the hell is this? Su Fan was stunned and then suddenly reacted. This is a download system. That is, it is possible to download someone else's talent. It's just that your 2G download speed is used to brush the sense of existence. Now that the 5G era has begun, okay. Bulma Tech. Su Fan felt that it was of little use, but with the mentality of trying it out, he still nodded a, yes. Start downloading, the current cellular data is 15 to 20k per second, and the estimated completion time is 1 hour. After Su Fan clicked a, yes, he found that a progress bar appeared in the sea of knowledge, and there was a note below the progress bar. Note. It can only be downloaded if the distance is within 10 meters. I go, is there a distance limit here? 10 meters. This hour inseparable from Bulma. Bulma is better to say, she is her girlfriend, not to mention maintaining a distance of 10 meters, even if it is a distance of zero, even a distance of negative centimeters, Su Fan can do it. But for Su Fan, Bulma's technology was of little use. This is the world of Dragon Ball, the combat power is bursting, and if you are not careful, the entire earth will be exploded. Su Fan must strengthen himself and stop being a weak chicken leping. By the way, I don't know what period of Dragon Ball it is. However, since leping can sleep with Bulma, it means that Vegeta has definitely not yet come to earth. Since I became leping, bah, it was leping who became my Su Fan. Then, from now on, this woman named Bulma will be taken care of by me Su Fan. Hey, Leping, what are you doing staring at me blankly? Do I get acne on my face? Bulma rubbed her eyes, stretched and woke up, looking at Su Fan and asking. Bulma, there is something I actually wanted to tell you a long time ago, Su Fan came back to his senses and said seriously to Bulma. What's going on? Bulma snorted and got up, are you fooling around with someone outside again? I don't want to hear it. Quote. Actually, my name is not Leping, my name is Su Fan. Su Fan said. Bulma was stunned. After a short silence. Poof. Bulma burst into laughter, like a blooming flower. Leping, you're so funny, when did you change your name? Bulma asked with a smile. From now on, don't call me Leping, my name is Su Fan. Su Fan said solemnly. Good, good, you can call it whatever you like, whatever. Bulma obviously doesn't care much about this kind of thing. By the way, what are your plans for today? Su Fan asked. I don't care, you have to accompany me to shopping today. Bulma pouted. How long have we not seen Goku? Su Fan really wanted to get in touch with Goku and see what he had on him that could be downloaded. Goku, don't you say I almost forgot about him? Bulma sighed slightly, didn't he get married five years ago? I haven't heard from you for five years. Quote. What? Married for five years. 
Su Fan lost his voice. What's so surprising? Bulma looked at Su Fan strangely. Su Fan was surprised because he knew very well that Dragon Ball would soon open the Saiyan era. That's right, this year, Monkey King's brother Raditz will come to Earth. In this battle, Sun Wukong and Raditz died together, and after that, Sun Wukong went to the planet of the Realm King to cultivate. A year later, with the arrival of Vegeta and Naba, all the rest of the warriors were killed except for Klin and Sun Gohan. Especially Leping, who died miserably. Those who were blown up alive by cultivators. Since I am Su Fan, I will definitely not allow this kind of thing to happen. Su Fan's eyes flickered. I'm surprised that I haven't contacted Goku for so long, and I kind of miss him. Su Fan said, after five years of marriage, shouldn't the children be playing soy sauce? Quote. What? Do you mean does Goku have a baby? Bulma got up stunned and asked. I'm just guessing. Su Fan smiled and said to Bulma, how about going to Goku's house today to play? Quote. Goku's home. I don't know where, after he and Kiki left five years ago, I wonder where he moved to live. Didn't leave his contact details either. Bulma whispered as she went to wash. With Goku's personality, he should go to find the four-star Dragon Ball left by his grandfather, Bulma, don't you have a Dragon Ball radar? Su Fan suggested. You're so smart, Leping, no, Su Fan. Bulma's eyes lit up, put the toothbrush in the toothbrush, and quickly went to find the Dragon Ball radar. And taking advantage of the time when Bulma was looking for the Dragon Ball radar, Su Fan carefully looked at his, Bulma technology, that was being downloaded at a tortuous speed. I went, sure enough, 15 to 20k per second, not at all deceptive. Moreover, most of them are around 15k per second. It's been 10 minutes, and it's only been about 4m downloads. 50m stuff, you actually have to download for an hour. Su Fan felt that this download speed was gone, and he had returned to the era of dial-up internet access. But fortunately, Su Fan didn't care much about this, Bulma technology, thing, just as a test product. Moreover, Bulma is Su Fan's pillow person, and it is too easy to download her things. No, not here. Oops, where did I put the Dragon Ball radar? Bulma scratched her ears and cheeks, I'll look over there. Quote. Saying that, Bulma, pedaled, and ran away. Weak signal. Beyond the distance. Download interrupted. Quote. Just after Bulma and Su Fan were more than 10 meters away, Su Fan found that a prompt to interrupt the download came from the Sea of Knowledge. Five minutes later. Found it. Bulma returns with the Dragon Ball radar. Su Fan pressed download again. It's just that what makes Su Fan speechless is. This special download is actually not resumable with a breakpoint. Need to go and download again, starting from zero. In this regard, Su Fan also had nothing to complain about. After all, in most novels, the system will be relatively low level at the beginning, and it will be slowly upgraded in the future. Fortunately, this, Bulma technology, is just a guinea pig for Su Fan. Su Fan leaned over to Bulma's side and looked at it, and found that the Dragon Ball radar showed seven sparkling bright spots. There are seven Dragon Balls, and my Dragon Ball radar doesn't mark a few star balls. Bulma is a little big-headed. Bulma, see if there are any Dragon Balls near Bun Mountain. Su Fan proposed. Bun Mountain. Where does Goku and his grandfather live? Bulma said, zooming in on the map, and sure enough, there was a Dragon Ball displayed on the other side of Bunzi Mountain. Goku and Kiki's home, it should be here. Su Fan pointed to the map and said affirmatively. Bulma looked at Su Fan suspiciously. How? Isn't that right? Su Fan asked. Not to mention, after you changed your name to Su Fan, you became smarter than before. Bulma said with a smile. So, names matter. Su Fan smiled. Okay. Let's go find Goku today, it just so happens that I also want to go around the country, and stay in the city all day, it's really boring. Bulma took a deep breath. So let's go. Su Fan greeted. Okay, let's go. Bulma did not object. After saying hello to Bulma's parents, a jet took to the blue sky and flew straight in the direction of Bunzi Mountain. Now Su Fan's prayer in his heart is that he must stay in Sun Wukong's house for a few days before Raditz comes to Earth. Although Su Fan is still not sure whether Sun Wukong's body can download any good things. 
Now, Su Fan's own leaping body, the combat effectiveness is only a little more than 100, which is really low and pitiful. And Su Fan also knew very well that leaping was not talented in this person, except for some boring wolf tooth wind fist that did not have any birds, he was basically useless. Su Fan must strengthen himself as soon as possible. An hour later. Beep. Download successful. Congratulations on getting Bulma technology. Quote. At this moment, a line of, download successful, appeared in Su Fan's sea of knowledge. Suddenly, Su Fan was pleasantly surprised to find that there was a lot of strange knowledge in his brain. At the same time, Su Fan also found that the jet controlled by Bulma could know the usefulness of each component on it. Is this what Bulma technology does? So, do you already have Bulma's high-tech mind? Although this skill is not of much use to Su Fan, it is better than nothing. In the future, if the spaceship is broken, at least you can repair it. Only, is Bulma just such a thing that can be downloaded? Su Fan held the heartbeat of trying it, and gently put his hand on Bulma's tender hand. What for? I'm flying an airplane. Bulma pouted and glared. Bulma, I admit that there have been many things that have not been done well over the years, but you can rest assured that I, Su Fan, will definitely take good care of you from now on and will never let you shed a single tear again. Su Fan solemnly promised. Bulma's whole body trembled. Even the plane almost fell from midair, so startled that the passing bird waved several feathers. The next moment, Bulma's eyes flashed with crystal tears, and she looked at Su Fan so obsessively. Happy, Su Fan. Bulma smiled. Su Fan nodded solemnly. Such a beautiful and cute girl. Leping gave it to Vegeta like this, what an idiot. At least Su Fan wouldn't do such a thing. Bulma High Tech, 200M, equivalent to the higher level of Bulma technology. Current cellular data, 2G. Current download speed, 15 to 20 KS. Reputation value, 0. B, do you want to download Bulma High Tech? When Su Fan's hand and Bulma's hand came into contact, he saw that there was an additional, Bulma High Tech, in the sea of knowledge. Download. Su Fan had nothing to hesitate to, and immediately turned on the download button. 200M things, according to the 2G traffic, Su Fan needs to download 4 hours. But Bulma is not someone else, let alone 4 hours, or 14 hours, it doesn't matter at all. Su Fan wants to see, after your special high-tech download is finished, will there be one more super high-tech? As long as you dare to have it, I dare to download it. 10 minutes later. Found it, it's there, look at Su Fan, there is a house below, it should be Wukong's home. Bulma pointed to a building below. Yes, that's right. Su Fan's impression was that this was indeed Wukong's home. Ah. The plane landed smoothly in the courtyard outside Goku's house. The environment here is still so beautiful, I think it would be more appropriate for me to move my family to live in a primeval forest. Bulma thought thoughtfully. Fa. As soon as Bulma's voice fell, she heard the sound of wolves howling from a distance. Bulma's face turned white with fright, and she couldn't help but snuggle up to Su Fan's body. Still no, I don't like the environment with wild wolves, said Bulma with a wry smile. It seems that the movement of the jet outside was heard, and the door of the house was also, popped, open. It was Goku's wife, Kiki, who opened the door. Ah, I know you, you are. Are you, Kiki looked at Su Fan, then at Bulma, and couldn't remember the name for a while. My name is Su Fan. Su Fan smiled, this is my girlfriend Bulma. Quote. Remember, remember, yes, yes, it's Su Fan, and Bulma. Kiki nodded, I heard Goku say that. Quote. What about Goku? Su Fan did not see Sun Wukong. Goku and Gohan went out hunting, should be back soon, right? Kiki said. Gohan. Who is it? Bulma asked curiously. Me and Goku's child. Kiki replied with a red face. What? Do you really have children? Bulma was surprised, took a deep look at Su Fan, and whispered, Hey, I really made you guess. Quote. Gohan is four years old this year. Kiki said, You guys are coming from afar, please come into the house. Quote. After chatting for a while in the room, Sun Wukong returned with the four-year-old son Gohan on his shoulder. Sun Wukong is still the same appearance that Su Fan is familiar with, wearing a set of orange and red loose clothes, looking leisurely and self-satisfied, belonging to the type of nerves. 
Sun Gohan is only four years old, seems to be a little afraid of life, grabbed Sun Wukong's collar, and looked at Su Fan and Bulma timidly, but it looked quite cute. In addition, Sun Gohan's hat is indeed inlaid with a four-star dragon ball. Also, as Su Fan knew, behind Sun Gohan, there was a long tail. Yay! Bulma! Leping! Why are you here? Sun Wukong was a little surprised after seeing the two. What Leping, Wukong, his name is Su Fan. Kiki corrected. Su Fan. Is it? How do I remember that his name is Leping? Sun Wukong was stunned for a moment. Yes, my name is Su Fan, Wukong, you remember wrong. Su Fan nodded. Is it? Am I misremembering? Sun Wukong didn't bother with the name problem, and looked at Bulma, Bulma, it's true that we haven't seen each other for a long time, right? How many years? Quote. Five years. Bulma hummed, Goku, you guys are true, if Su Fan hadn't managed to find you through the Dragon Balls, I wouldn't have known you had moved here. Quote. Ha ha. Sun Wukong smiled and touched the back of his head, speaking of which, I still plan to find the grandfather of the Turtle Immortals the day after tomorrow. Quote. The day after tomorrow. Su Fan's face changed color. So, will Raditz come the day after tomorrow? Goku, you must have been practicing seriously over the years, right? It should have become stronger. Su Fan regained his composure and took the opportunity to pat Sun Wukong's shoulder. The next moment, Su Fan seemed to have picked up a big gift package and found six things that could be downloaded. Combat Effectiveness 416, 416M. Turtle Pai Qigong Wave, 30M. Saiyan Heritage, 300M. Light of Justice, 100M. Dance Technique, 10M. After Image Fist, 30M. Seeing these few things that can be downloaded, the others are quite average, and what makes Su Fan's heart the most is that Saiyan Inheritance and Combat Effectiveness 416. Is it possible to pass on the Saiyans to download them, and you can have the bloodline of the Saiyans? 300M. With a 2G network, Su Fan calculated that it would take at least 6 hours. But that's not a problem, as long as you stay at Goku's house until about 9 o'clock in the evening from now until the evening, you can complete the download. And that combat power 416, is it a mal meaning? Su Fan slapped his head and seemed to remember, it seems that the Monkey King in this period has a combat effectiveness of a little more than 400. In this way, the combat power of 416 is the combat power value of Sun Wukong. As for the three, Turtle Sect Qigong Wave, Light of Justice, and Dancing Void Technique, Su Fan will have the opportunity to download them slowly in the future. The most important thing now is that Su Fan must download Sun Wukong's combat power as soon as possible. Immediately, Su Fan chose to download combat power 416. Whether to replace the current combat strength 177. The system gives such a hint. Muggles, is a replacement, not an accumulation. It's a bit of a pain in this specialty. Since it is a replacement. Su Fan temporarily terminated the download and set his sights on Sun Wuhan. What's your name, little one? Su Fan touched Sun Gohan's little face and said with a smile. My name is Sun Gohan, I am four years old this year, and I want to be a great scientist when I grow up. Sun Gohan said sweetly. There is a real tutor. Bulma smiled and said, this is all taught by Kiki, right? Quote. Yes, usually I just take Gohan out to hunt and teach Gohan, and the things that teach Gohan are all handed over to Kiki. Monkey King nodded. You guys talk slowly, I'll cook. Kiki said politely. Then you're welcome. Su Fan nodded. Then, Su Fan looked at Sun Wuhan again and saw the Dong Dong that Sun Wuhan could download. Combat Effectiveness 1307. 1.3G. Saiyan Heritage. 300M. Tail. 100M. Only these three can be downloaded. When Su Fan saw the download option, tail, he was almost happy. Is this tail counted in it? However, Su Fan felt that the tail was the source of Saiyan's strength, and it was better to have it than nothing. Among these download options, the most exciting thing for Su Fan is the Combat Power 1307, which is beyond the existence of Raditz. If you download this combat power, when Sun Wukong's brother comes, you can make a move. In addition, Su Fan found that his reputation value was still zero. How to obtain this reputation value? Su Fan can basically guess 1, 2, 3. 
It's just that 1.3G is such a big combat power, Su Fan slightly estimated, at least 26 hours to download. This combat power is a bit expensive. One combat power is 1M, if 5G is opened, it will be downloaded quickly. It's just that at present, Su Fan is only 2G network speed. In other words, he needs to be accompanied by Sun Gohan all day and night. Fight it. Su Fan still doesn't believe it, isn't it just a four-year-old child? As an adult, wouldn't he still coax a child? Thinking of this, Su Fan did not hesitate any longer, and immediately pressed the download of, say an inheritance. What the? Not to download combat power. That one is not in a hurry, wait for the Saiyan inheritance to be downloaded, and then download the combat power. Start downloading, the current cellular data is 15 to 20k per second, and the estimated completion time is 6 hours. Su Fan counted the time, it was about 3 o'clock in the afternoon, Kiki went to dinner, after dinner, and then played a game together, such as playing cards or something, 6 hours passed. Su Fan took a deep breath. Su Fan was looking forward to it. Today, I will also become a Saiyan. Fighting Nation Saiyan. However, when Su Fan began to download, Saiyan Inheritance, he found that the download speed was reduced to about 7k 10k per second. Did I make a mistake? Why does the download speed slow down? Su Fan thought about it carefully, and suddenly realized. I'll go. This is because I also downloaded, Bulma High Tech and the two downloaded together, resulting in an average download speed. In other words, this system can be multitask download, but the network speed is so pitiful, the more downloads, the overall speed is slower. Su Fan immediately terminated the download of, Bulma High Tech. Bulma High Tech, in the future, Su Fan has time to download, no need to rush for a while. Sure enough, after Su Fan terminated the download of, Bulma High Tech, the download speed of, Saiyan Heritage, became 15 to 20k per second. Su Fan breathed a sigh of relief. By the way, Su Fan, I haven't found someone to talk to for a long time, or should we go out and have a discussion? Sun Wukong smiled and looked at Su Fan and asked. Haha, forget it. Su Fan smiled, so that he would not look for abuse. Even if he wanted to talk, Su Fan would have to wait until two days later. Okay. Sun Wukong nodded, looking a little lost. Sun Wukong also knew that Su Fan didn't like to fight, and if he changed to Klin, he might be able to play with him. Su Fan suddenly saw that Bulma looked at her eyes with a trace of disappointment. Su Fan knew that as her man, in the face of such a thing, he actually took the initiative to admit defeat, and a woman would be insecure. And Su Fan also knew that Bulma really felt that she had chosen the wrong object and should find a man like Sun Wukong. Of course, Su Fan couldn't let Bulma's heart be lost, and he would definitely not allow this kind of thing to happen. Goku, I've neglected to cultivate lately, but as long as I give me two days, I think I'll surpass you. Su Fan's face was full of confidence. That confident look made Bulma can't help but light up her eyes a little after seeing it. Really? Can two days surpass me? Sun Wukong also suddenly came to the spirit, he likes opponents who are stronger than him. Yes. Su Fan nodded with a smile and made a promise in a solemn tone, two days later, we will have a good discussion. Quote. Well, I'm looking forward to it. Sun Wukong clenched his fists excitedly. Su Fan. Bulma beckoned to Su Fan. Su Fan leaned over. Are you serious? Bulma leaned into Su Fan's ear and asked in a low voice. What's serious? Su Fan asked puzzled. It's just a fight with Goku. Bulma asked. Of course it's serious, I'm not kidding. Su Fan nodded affirmatively. Well, I really don't understand you men, I know how to fight and kill. That being said, Bulma's eyes looking at Su Fan were no longer as disappointed as before. Bulma, I said I would protect you, and I won't let you get hurt a little in the future. Su Fan took Bulma's hand with a solemn expression. HMPH, as long as you don't go out and mess with the grass, I'll be satisfied. Bulma pouted, her face flushed, save the earth or something, just have Goku. Quote. Su Fan smiled and didn't say anything more. Two hours later, Kiki had already finished cooking. And Su Fan saw the download progress bar of, say an inheritance, which also reached 35%. As long as you stick to it for another four hours, you can complete the download of, say an heritage. 
By the way, I suddenly remembered that I fought a dinosaur with Gohan before and forgot to bring it back, well, it should be good to eat grilled. Sun Wukong slapped his brain, summoned the cloud, and jumped up at once. Dad, I'm going too. Sun Gohan said quickly. Okay. Sun Wukong fell, carried Sun Wuhan on his shoulders, and greeted Su Fan and Bulma, I'll come back when I go. Quote. Wait. Su Fan said quickly. Su Fan's download can be resumed without the breakpoint resumption function, which has been downloaded for more than two hours, if it is interrupted, it will have to be repeated. Su Fan chose to download Sun Gohan's, say an inheritance, as long as Sun Wuhan does not leave his 10 meters away, he can always download it. Now Sun Wukong is going to take Gohan to find some dinosaur, so that Su Fan doesn't know what to say. Dinosaurs don't need anything, Bulma and I don't eat them. Su Fan said. It's okay, I'll eat with Gohan. Sun Wukong replied. Gohan, shall the two of us make a game? Su Fan smiled at Sun Wuhan. What game? Uncle Su Fan. Sun Gohan suddenly became interested. You see, there are a few coins here, I'll put the coins on the table to see who has the most. Su Fan said with a smile. Uh huh, fun, fun. Sun Gohan was just a four year old child, and he immediately applauded. Then I'll go get the dinosaurs, Gohan, you stay and have fun. Sun Wukong said, flying into the sky under the bearing of the tendon cloud. Su Fan breathed a sigh of relief. After eating, Su Fan saw that the download progress had reached 61%, and the estimated completion time was still two and a half hours. It's not early, Su Fan, let's go home. Bulma looked at the sky and said to Su Fan. Don't worry, let's stay here at night. I haven't seen you for a long time, how can I have a good chat? Su Fan said with a smile. That's embarrassing. Bulma shook her head slightly. Bulma, aren't you a universal capsule with a house? We built a house next to Goku's home, and it's good to live there, the air here is so fresh, how depressing it is to live in the city. Su Fan proposed. I have to say, Su Fan, you have a good idea. Bulma was a little moved by what he said, and immediately took out a universal capsule and threw it out casually. Bang. The universal capsule turned into a small house. I'm going to take a shower and watch TV for a while, and you guys keep playing. Bulma stretched. In the following time, Su Fan patiently played with Sun Wuhan in order not to have any moths. Of course, Su Fan mainly played games such as playing cards, puzzles, playing games, and talking books with Gohan, and did not let Sun Gohan let himself go. Su Fan clearly knew how powerful Sun Wuhan's combat power was. If he plays hide and seek with Sun Gohan, this little devil will not be allowed to go to heaven. Finally, Su Fan's, Saiyan inheritance, reached 99.99%. B. Download complete. The system's prompt also appeared in Su Fan's sea of knowledge. Phew. It's not easy. Su Fan quickly felt his body. At the moment when Su Fan had just downloaded the, Saiyan inheritance, Su Fan obviously felt that his physical fitness had become stronger than before. At the same time, the body is also full of a lot of power. It seems that the hidden strength of the Saiyans is awakening. Su Fan's heart moved, and he quickly opened the, Combat Power 1307, to download Sun Wuhan, through this method, you can check your combat power value. Do you want to replace the current combat strength 288? The system gives such a hint. In other words, after Su Fan opened the Saiyan inheritance, his combat effectiveness had increased from the previous 177 to 288. However, Su Fan felt that this was not enough. After Vegeta came to Earth, tens of thousands of combat power were not enough for him to abuse. Su Fan must seize the time and continue to improve himself. That's right, tail. Download Sun Gohan's, tail. The tail is only 100m and it only takes 2 hours to download. It's a big deal to lose 2 hours of Sun Gohan playing. Immediately, Su Fan opened the download program of, tail. 2 hours later, the download progress is successfully completed. At the moment when the download progress was completed, Su Fan felt that there was an extra fluffy thing in his pants, and he could control it as he wanted. It is the unique tail of the Saiyan. Su Fan was overjoyed in his heart and quickly checked his combat strength value. Combat Effectiveness 352. 
After having the tail, Su Fan's combat effectiveness increased from 288 to 352. This made Su Fan a little excited. Today, Su Fan's combat effectiveness, like riding a train, soared from 177 to 352. Moreover, Su Fan also opened the bloodline of the Saiyans. From today onwards, Su Fan is a member of the Saiyan fighting nation. Suddenly, Su Fan also felt that the blood in his body seemed to boil, and he even wanted to go out and fight with Sun Wukong for 300 rounds. However, Su Fan knew that his combat effectiveness was more than 50 years behind Sun Wukong. In addition, in terms of combat skills, he is far inferior to Sun Wukong. Finding abuse is not Su Fan's style. Enduring his own boiling blood, Su Fan gritted his teeth and opened the Combat Power 1307 to download Sun Gohan. However, immediately afterwards, Su Fan terminated the download on his own. Since I'm also a Saiyan, I still know so much about the world of Dragon Ball, why should I download someone else's combat power? I can achieve higher combat effectiveness through my own efforts. Su Fan was not a Saiyan before, and knowing that the gap between himself and the Saiyan was definitely not easy to make up. But now that he already has a Saiyan heritage, there is no difference between him and a Saiyan, why download someone else's combat power? This is not Su Fan's style. If Su Fan's guess is correct, at the latest the day after tomorrow, Raditz will come to Earth. You must buy time to cultivate hard and have higher combat effectiveness. Only, how to cultivate. It is worth mentioning that Lepping's body also retains some of the cultivation methods of the Turtle Fairy Flow, such as the Turtle School Qigong Wave. For these, Su Fan can be used normally. Su Fan knew that the best way for Saiyans to improve their combat effectiveness was to put themselves on the verge of death, and then heal through immortal beans, and their combat effectiveness could be doubled. It's just that the fairy beans of this period. Su Fan didn't remember how many more. At least a year later, with the arrival of Vegeta and Naba, only one Sendo remained. I don't know how there was no fairy bean in that jar back then. Su Fan decided to go to Garen Tower to meet the Garen Immortals. Thinking of this, Su Fan said goodbye to the Wukong family for the time being. Uncle Su Fan, good night, let's continue playing tomorrow. Sun Gohan waved his small hand. Okay, no problem. Su Fan patted Gohan's little head and beckoned to Goku. Sun Wukong walked out and looked at Su Fan puzzled. Goku, I always have a bad premonition in the past two days, feeling that a powerful opponent will come to Earth. Su Fan sighed. A strong opponent. Coming to Earth. Sun Wukong's eyes lit up slightly, and a trace of excitement appeared on his face. This opponent is probably not what you can match now. Su Fan said. Don't worry. Su Fan, I will definitely work hard to cultivate. Sun Wukong nodded, seemingly not taking this matter to heart. I want to go find the Garen Immortal and follow him to cultivate and cultivate, maybe it will come in handy at that time. Su Fan said. Ha ha, Su Fan, you can cultivate seriously, and Bulma will be very happy. Sun Wukong laughed. I say this to borrow your somersault cloud to use. Su Fan said the point. Do you? Of course no problem. Sun Wukong was stunned for a moment, and then scratched his head and looked at Su Fan in puzzlement, but Su Fan, I remember that you can't sit on the clouds. Quote. Not necessarily. Su Fan's face was full of confidence. Su Fan really thought about it enough. At this time, although Leping could dance a little in the air, he could only temporarily levitate in the air. So for Su Fan, the best means of transportation is Duyun. In addition, the cloud is several times faster than Bulma's jet. Also, Duyun is a treasure of the Garen Immortals, and riding the Duyun to find him saves a lot of trouble. Good. Sun Wukong nodded and shouted loudly, Duyun. Quote. Phew. Under the night, golden clouds quickly appeared beside Sun Wukong. Su Fan calmed down and blocked all distractions in his heart. Immediately afterwards, Su Fan jumped lightly and stepped on the clouds with both feet. It's coming up. Wow. Su Fan, you can ah. You can ride the somersault cloud. Sun Wukong said happily. Snap. Su Fan jumped from the somersault cloud. What's wrong? Not to the Garen Immortals. Monkey King asked. Before leaving, I'll go say hello to Bulma. Su Fan said. Uh, okay, then I'll go back to sleep first. Monkey King nodded. Good. Su Fan waved his hand. 
Su Fan turned and came to the small house that Bulma had made out of capsules. Bulma was sitting on the sofa watching TV, wearing a pink bathrobe, with a faint fragrance on her body, and her hair was a little wet, obviously freshly bathed. Su Fan, you're back. Bulma greeted. Bulma, tell you, I'm going to go to Garinta. Su Fan said. Garinta. Why? Go now. Bulma was stunned. Yes, let's go now, I've already asked Goku to borrow a somersault cloud, and it will be no more than an hour at most. Su Fan sat down next to Bulma, I have a foreboding that a powerful figure may appear recently, and I still understand the truth of planning ahead. Quote. Powerful characters appear. Bulma pouted, with Goku, what do you have to worry about? Quote. What if Goku isn't his match either? Su Fan smiled. Goku will have a way. Bulma was stunned for a moment and continued. Bulma, you are my woman, I will not allow you to put all your expectations on Goku's body in the future. Su Fan looked at Bulma with a solemn expression. Bulma froze for a while, blinking her beautiful eyes and looking at Su Fan. Poof. Bulma laughed all at once. Me, Su Fan, never allow my woman to be snatched away by another man. Su Fan said, hugged Bulma tightly and hugged her in his arms. Bulma's expression was a little confused, and she was a little overwhelmed for a while. Bulma, I'll go to Garinta first, wait for me to come back. Su Fan patted Bulma's back. Hmm, Bulma answered mechanically. Su Fan turned around and left. Bulma looked at Su Fan's back blankly. To Bulma's feeling, Su Fan has changed a lot. Even, Bulma felt that this man could definitely entrust himself for life. He is no longer the leping he used to be. Su Fan left the room. The next moment, Bulma quickly chased after him. Hey, when are you coming back? Bulma asked. I'll come and pick you up tomorrow. Su Fan smiled back. Okay, I'll wait for you. Bulma nodded. Snap. Su Fan jumped on the somersault cloud. Bulma's beautiful eyes widened, her small mouth opened slightly, and her expression was stunned. You you you, can you ride a somersault cloud? Bulma asked in surprise. I've always been able to ride on somersaults, have you forgotten? Su Fan smiled slightly, I'm leaving. Quote. Ah, uh, Bulma's eyes widened. Phew. The clouds soared into the sky and retreated into the starry sky, leaving a shallow golden color in the sky. This Su Fan, I didn't expect to have a handsome side. Bulma had a shallow smile on her face. Fa. In the distance, a wolf howl came melodiously. Bulma glanced at Goku's door closed, and even the lights in the room went dark. Snap. Bulma quickly turned around and closed the door. Abominable. Su Fan. You just left me behind. Bulma leaned against the door, clenched her fists, and shouted. Su Fan rode on the somersault cloud and flew quickly in the direction of Garinta. On the way, Su Fan felt that he had to master the art of dancing as soon as possible. Otherwise, when Raditz comes, or even Vegeta and Frieza and the others who appear a year later, it will already be cool to practice air dancing. Su Fan held his breath and concentrated, mobilized the energy in his body, and slowly suspended his body and left the somersault cloud. Phew. Duyun rushed out directly, seemed to find that the person he was carrying was missing, and looked back inexplicably. Well, it's levitating. Su Fan nodded with satisfaction, the next step is to use your own energy to let yourself fly quickly. It was a bit uncomfortable at first, but I think with my talent, I should learn to fly soon. Quote. Duyun, come, pull me. Su Fan beckoned to the somersault cloud. The cloud was still very spiritual, and he immediately slowed down. Su Fan stretched out his hand and grabbed the tail of the somersault cloud. Okay, Duyun, now full speed ahead. Su Fan ordered. Du Yun, are you using me to practice flying? Phew. Du Yun took Su Fan to cut a golden arc in the sky. About 15 minutes or so. Su Fan tried to let go of the somersault cloud and fly by himself. Not to mention, through this method, Su Fan has successfully mastered the method of flying. However, compared with Su Fan's current speed in somersault cloud, there is still a certain gap. In this regard, Su Fan has nothing to be unbalanced, as long as his combat effectiveness is greatly improved, the flight speed will naturally rise. After more than 20 minutes of flight practice, Su Fan was already able to successfully soar in the sky. 
At this moment, Su Fan saw a giant pillar standing in the distance from a distance. Exactly Garinta. Su Fan let Duyun take him and flew directly above Garin Tower. Snap. Su Fan descended from the sky and entered the Garin Tower. There are currently two people inside Garin Tower, one is the Garin Immortal and the other is Archie Loeb. Su Fan knew that since Archirobe came to Garinta with Goku on his back during the Vic Great Demon King, he had basically lived with the Garin Immortals. At this time, Archie Loeb was already sitting on the ground and sleeping. However, the Garin Immortal was holding a crutch and silently staring at Su Fan who appeared in the tower. It's leaping, come to me so late, what's the matter? When the Garin Immortal asked this, he took a deep look at the somersault cloud under Su Fan's feet. My name is Su Fan, Garin Immortal, you remember wrong. Su Fan smiled. Is it? Your name is Su Fan. Garin was visibly stunned. Garin Immortal, I'm sorry to come and disturb you so late. Su Fan said sincerely, I came here because I have a bad premonition, in a short time, there may be an evil guy appearing. I want to seriously cultivate and cultivate, and then I can also contribute some strength to everyone. Quote. Don't worry, there is Goku, that guy who can even defeat the Vic Great Devil, what else can't be solved? The Garin Immortal thought it was something, and immediately yawned and stretched. I know that with Goku here, there will be no problem. Su Fan nodded and said, but just in case, I need a little fairy bean. Quote. Sendo. The Garin Immortal was stunned, raised his eyes and asked, what do you want that for? Quote. Just plan ahead. Su Fan smiled. Okay. Garin Immortal did not refuse, immediately took out a bag, casually threw it to Su Fan, and yawned and said, there are only two left, and the growth of Immortal Beans has not been very good recently. Quote. I remember that there were a lot of Immortal Beans coming, Su Fan reached out to pick up the Immortal Beans. Didn't you let this foodie eat? The Garin Immortal glanced at Archie Loeb angrily. At the moment when Su Fan and Garin Immortal's claws had just come into contact, several download options also appeared in Su Fan's Sea of Knowledge. Summon All Somersault, 100M. Dance Technique, 10M. After Image Fist, 30M. Cultivation of Fairy Beans, 100M. Breath Sensing, 50M. Seeing a certain download option here, Su Fan's eyes lit up. Fairy Bean Cultivation. Is it possible to download this and successfully open the technology of growing fairy beans in the future? In this way, with endless fairy beans, there will be an extra guarantee in the future battle process. Immediately, Su Fan did not have the slightest hesitation and directly pressed the download of Immortal Bean Cultivation. The 100M, Immortal Bean Cultivation, with Su Fan's current network speed, only takes two hours to download. Thank you, Garin Immortal. Su Fan also stretched out and yawned, it's not early, can I stay and rest tonight? Quote. Whatever you want. The Garin Immortals did not object. The Garin Immortals did not have much affection for Leping as a person, nor did they have much bad feelings. Su Fan sat down within 10 meters of the Garin Immortal and closed his eyes. Two hours later, Su Fan successfully downloaded and completed, Fairy Bean Cultivation. Suddenly, a series of information about the cultivation of immortal beans flooded into Su Fan's mind. After learning this information, Su Fan knew that if he wanted to grow fairy beans, he really could not grow them overnight. However, since this technique has been downloaded, it will definitely be useful in the future. Su Fan looked through the other download options of the Garin Immortal again. The fairy bean cultivation that has been downloaded still exists, and there is a parenthesis at the back, which says learned which shows that the downloaded content can continue to be downloaded, but it is of little use. After a short silence, Su Fan's gaze was fixed on the ability of, breath sensing. The breath sensing is only 50m, and it only takes one hour to download. The ability to sense breath, put a year later, the time when Vegeta and Naba descended, already belongs to the ability of Rotten Street. However, nowadays, the ability to sense breath is not very popular. Or it can be said that even if Sun Wukong and Vic can, they can only sense a little distance, which may be the reason why they are not very skillful. Su Fan must master this skill as soon as possible, and fortunately, after Raditz came to Earth, he learned his whereabouts as soon as possible. Immediately, Su Fan turned on the ability to download, breath sensing. 
Not to mention, it's so convenient to download things at night. An hour later, the breath sensing was also successfully downloaded by Su Fan. Suddenly, Su Fan's mind flooded with some techniques related to breath sensing. Su Fan only practiced a little, and he could clearly sense the aura of Garen Immortal and Archiro beside him. Immediately afterwards, Su Fan closed his eyes, took a deep breath, and let go of the induction. Soon, Su Fan could clearly sense the powerful aura of Sun Wukong in the distant Bun Mountain. And, of course, the faint breath of Bulma. Su Fan continued to let go of the induction, trying to sense the entire planet. It didn't take long for Su Fan to sense that an extremely powerful aura appeared at a distance of more than 600 kilometers from him. This breath was only a little stronger than Su Fan. Su Fan guessed that this person's eight achievements were Vic Chi. Phew. Su Fan got what he deserved from the Garen Immortals, and immediately took a deep breath. Then, Su Fan stepped forward and patted the shoulder of the Garen Immortal. What's going on? Garen Immortal opened one eye and asked lightly. Did you sleep? Garen Immortals. Su Fan asked. Garen Immortal. Did I just fall asleep? You told me not to ask this question, would you? Garen Immortal is not popular. I'm leaving, tell you. Su Fan said. Ah, you feel free. The Garen Immortals obviously didn't take Su Fan too seriously. Goodbye. Su Fan smiled, but did not think too much. Strength speaks for everything. In this Dragon Ball world, the original Leping really belongs to the existence of soy sauce. It's no wonder that the Garen Immortals don't treat him very much. Su Fan knew that as long as his strength surpassed Wukong, these people would automatically impress him. Su Fan took off into the air and flew quickly towards the sky. Huh. The Garen Immortal was stunned for a moment, squinting his eyes and looking upwards. What the Garen Immortals didn't expect was that Su Fan could actually dance the Void Art, and he seemed to have mastered it quite well. Also, Su Fan, this kid flew up, what was he going to do? Hey, where are you going? The Garen Immortal hurriedly caught up and asked. I'm going to meet the gods. Su Fan smiled and waved his hand. What do you say? Boy, don't make trouble, how can the gods of heaven be seen by anyone casually? Garen Immortal said angrily. Can't see it, it's not for him to decide. Su Fan smiled. The reason why I say this is also because Su Fan's strength has surpassed that of the heavenly god now. Su Fan remembered that the combat power of the heavenly god seemed to be around 220, which could also be judged purely from the strength of the breath. Phew. Su Fan increased the speed of flight, and the whole person sped towards the direction of the celestial realm. I don't know how long I flew, Su Fan obviously felt that the air around him was getting thinner and thinner, and even breathing became difficult. After flying for another distance, Su Fan finally saw the temple suspended in the sky. Snap! Su Fan landed on the edge of the temple and walked unhurriedly towards the front. Then, Su Fan saw Mr. Bobo who was dark under the moonlight, staring at the bean eyes, his eyes looking at him indifferently. Leping, what are you doing here so late? Mr. Bobo was silent for a moment, unable to understand that Leping would fly to the temple. Correct, my name is Su Fan, not Leping. Su Fan said. Okay. Mr. Bobo nodded. What about the gods? I have important things to see him. Su Fan said to Mr. Bobo. Tell me something, it's so late, the gods won't see you. Mr. Bobo said expressionlessly. That's fine. Su Fan was not too rude to Mr. Bobo. Su Fan knew very well that this Mr. Bobo was actually a person with relatively strong combat effectiveness. Su Fan remembered that he had seen the official combat effectiveness data, and it seemed that the official gave Mr. Bobo's combat effectiveness above 1000. Moreover, in the later period, Mr. Bobo also accompanied Sun Wushan and Trunks to cultivate, and his combat effectiveness should be higher. I came here to borrow the room of spirit and time to cultivate. Su Fan said. Spirit and time. You heard that from Goku, right? Mr. Bobo asked. Yes. Su Fan smiled slightly. After a short silence. Come with me. Mr. Bobo nodded and did not object. Under the leadership of Mr. Bobo, Su Fan finally came to the door of the room of spirit and time. Snap. The door to a different dimension of spirit and time has opened. How much did Goku say to you about spirit and time? Mr. Bobo asked with some apprehension. 
I didn't say much, I only know that one year here is equal to one day outside, and I don't know much else, and I hope Mr. Bobo will explain more. Su Fan said politely. Okay, then I'll give you a brief explanation. Mr. Bobo explains, the environment here is extremely harsh, the gravity is ten times that of the outside, but the air is only one-tenth of the outside, and the temperature difference is also very large, the temperature is usually between 50 degrees and minus 40 degrees, the will is weak and the spirit is not concentrated, and hallucinations are prone to appear in it. Quote. Su Fan nodded without changing his face. In fact, he already knew this. Are you sure you want to stay here and cultivate? Mr. Bobo looked at Yi Tian and asked. Of course. Su Fan smiled. Mr. Bobo took a deep look at Su Fan. However, Mr. Bobo did not know much about Su Fan, that is, leping before, so he did not know his specific character, and since Su Fan had agreed to stay and cultivate, Mr. Bobo did not have much to say. When the door is closed, the change of environment and gravity will automatically open, if it is really unbearable, come out as soon as possible. Mr. Bobo kindly persuaded, even Goku, I think he only spent three months in it, and he couldn't bear it. Quote. I understand, thank you. Su Fan nodded and did not go to contact Mr. Bobo. The temple is not as small as Garinta. The temple covers a vast area, and Su Fan can't follow Mr. Bobo all the time, so it is not easy to download the abilities on his body. Su Fan knew that Mr. Bobo should have a lot of things to download. However, in any case, the most important thing now is to improve the combat effectiveness as king. Su Fan now has two immortal beans, and through these two immortal beans, coupled with hard cultivation, can't he make the combat power exceed a thousand? Well, good luck, then. Mr. Bobo waved at Yi Tian and left the room of spirit and time. Snap. The door is closed. Suddenly, an extremely powerful sense of pressure rushed over Su Fan's body. Su Fan felt his body sink, and he almost fell to his knees. Su Fan's breath also burst out immediately, trying to make himself stand tall. Taking a deep breath, Su Fan left the room, entered the white earth, and ran slowly on the ground. Ten times the earth's gravity is indeed a huge challenge for Su Fan. At the same time, the environment here is really harsh enough. Now it was just 50 degrees of high temperature, Su Fan's body was soon soaked with sweat, and the whole person was evaporating like water vapor, emitting layers of white gas. However, before Su Fan could overcome this 50 degree high temperature, the air immediately became cold. The howling cold wind froze the sweat on Su Fan's body into ice slag at that time. Also, in this space, the oxygen content was too low, so that Su Fan's breathing could not keep up with the rhythm. In this kind of place, if ordinary people come in, I am afraid that they can hold on for three minutes. I'm going to work hard. I want to come on. I want to get stronger. Su Fan clenched his fists and fought against this harsh environment. Raditz, Naba, Vegeta, Well, and Frieza, you guys wait. I, Su Fan, will definitely defeat you. Early the next morning. Hey, Su Fan, get up, aren't we going to see Teacher Wushin today? Monkey King knocked on the door and shouted at Bulma in the room. After waiting for more than half an hour, Bulma walked out dressed neatly. Huh, what about Su Fan? Monkey King craned his neck and looked into the room. Bang. Kiki punched Sun Wukong's head. Kiki, why did you hit me? Monkey King scratched his head. Girls' boudoirs, what do you see? Kiki said with a dark face. What do you mean? Monkey King was confused. Goku, what did you just say? Are you going to find Teacher Wushin? Bulma smiled and quickly asked. Yes, didn't I say that yesterday? I'm going to find Teacher Wu Tien today. Sun Wukong scratched his head. You're talking about tomorrow. Bulma replied angrily. I also remember it was tomorrow. Kiki nodded. I said the day after tomorrow yesterday, isn't it today? Sun Wukong thought thoughtfully. Kiki. Bulma. Goku stupid, the day after tomorrow means tomorrow tomorrow. Kiki really didn't know what to say. Huh. Is it? Ha ha, I'm confused. Sun Wukong smiled indifferently and asked, by the way, what about Su Fan? Yes, remembering it, last night he asked me to borrow the Duyun to find the Garen Immortals. Quote. What do you remember? Bulma had a black face. Ha ha ha, I slept too late yesterday, we never slept so late, I went to bed around 8 o'clock at night. 
Sun Wukong scratched his head and smiled. Su Fan entered the spirit and time, five hours. Temple. Hee hee, I didn't think that kid named Su Fan could last so long. Mr. Bobo looked at the clock outside and couldn't help but be a little surprised. Five hours, which is equivalent to two and a half months in it. For an ordinary person, it is indeed rare to be able to last so long. Mr. Bobo, what happened? The god got up at this time, came out of the temple, and asked. Heavenly God, at two o'clock this morning, Su Fan flew up to the temple, saying that he wanted to borrow the room of spirit and time to cultivate. Mr. Bobo replied truthfully. Su Fan, who is it? The heavenly god was stunned for a moment, and had no impression of Su Fan at all. Ah, uh, his previous name was Leping, I don't know why he changed his name. Mr. Bobo scratched his head. It's him, the heavenly god sighed slightly, I remember that five years ago at the first martial arts meeting in the world, I fought him, and although he is also an excellent martial artist, his strength is too much. The words that followed by the god were not spoken, but the meaning in the words was already obvious. Yes. Mr. Bobo nodded slightly, but when I saw Su Fan this time, I seemed to feel that his strength had improved by leaps and bounds. Quote. What? The face of the god of heaven changed color. Tenjin, I mean his strength has improved by leaps and bounds, Mr. Bobo didn't know why the god was so surprised. I, 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 I'm not saying that he, I mean, what's over there? The face of the heavenly god became extremely ugly, and he looked straight towards the far north. What's wrong? God. Mr. Bobo asked puzzled, and also quickly looked in the direction of the gods. Look over there. There is a round meteorite that descends from space, no, not a meteorite. That's a spaceship. When the god said this, his body began to tremble, I can sense that inside that spaceship, there is a very powerful alien. Quote. Mr. Bobo was stunned and widened his eyes. What is his purpose? Is he going to invade Earth? The god croaked his teeth and clenched his fists. Tenjin, there is Goku, even if an alien comes, I believe Goku will defeat him. Mr. Bobo comforted. Hopefully, Tenjin said in a deep voice, he came out, he had long hair, a strange thing on his eyes, and a very peculiar armor on his body. Quote. Tenjin, Mr. Bobo was the first time he had seen Tenjin so gaff. Far north. Raditz's spaceship smashed a crater on this rural path. Su Fan, who was cultivating in the room of spirit and time, never expected that Raditz would come to Earth at this time. According to Su Fan's estimates, Raditz should not arrive on Earth until tomorrow. After all, Sun Wukong also said that he would take Gohan to visit the Turtle Immortals tomorrow. It's just that where does Su Fan know that Sun Wukong, the pit goods, still confuses the two meanings of, tomorrow, and, the day after tomorrow. Ah someone came out of it. Quote. A farmer armed with a rifle saw Raditz appear, and his expression was full of shock. Don't move. Dare to step forward and I will shoot. The farmer snapped his hands and quickly loaded the rifle and aimed it at Raditz. HMPH, a scumbag with only five combat effectiveness. Raditz's face was full of disdain, why? Why are there still humans on this planet? Kakarot, have you forgotten the task given to you? Quote. As he said this, Raditz walked towards the farmer step by step. Wow, whoa. The farmer was terrified, shouted for himself to be bold, and then pulled the trigger in his hand. Bang. Gunshots rang out. Raditz grabbed the bullet lightly and grabbed the bullet in his hand. Bang. Raditz ejected the bullet and hit the farmer in the head. The farmer died instantly. Okay, let me take a closer look. Raditz pressed the detector and turned his head to look into the distance. Well, at a distance of 4880, there is a powerful combat existence, is it Kakarot? Quote. Phew. Raditz soared into the air and sped off into the distance. Bhikkhu was closing his eyes and recuperating his mind did not take long to sense a powerful energy rushing towards his position. Bike's face became extremely ugly. What? A powerful energy is approaching. Who is it? Is it the Monkey King? Bik said quietly. Soon, Bik saw Raditz speeding towards him. It's not the Monkey King. Who is he? Bike's face changed wildly. Snap. Raditz landed directly opposite Bik and looked at Bik faintly. Bik also silently looked at Raditz. You're not the person I'm looking for, people like you are useless to me. Raditz said lightly to Bik. What do you say? 
Do you know who you are talking to? Bike's body trembled slightly, and a scowl emerged. I don't know. Raditz looked flat. Bike's body trembled more and more intensely, and cold sweat broke out on his face. This guy's energy is amazing. Bick clenched his fists. Wow. Whoa. Immediately afterwards, Bick roared, and a huge energy was released in his hand, which bombarded Raditz's body at that time. When the smoke cleared, Raditz was safe and sound. Is this your attack? It's just a cloud of dust. Raditz shook his head, looking disappointed. Despair and fear appeared on Bick's face. It's terrible. Who the hell is this guy? Why is it so powerful? Now it's my turn to attack, right? I'll show you what to see. Raditz shook his right hand and slowly flew up. Bick suddenly felt like a great enemy. Huh. Another combat power reaction, distance 2560, he should be the most powerful existence on this planet. Raditz smiled slightly, did not pay any more attention to Bike, and sped towards the direction of Bunzi Mountain where Sun Wukong was. Seeing Raditz walk away, Bik suddenly breathed a long sigh of relief. Temple. Hem, the face of the celestial god became more and more ugly, and he could feel the horror of this person from Bike's demeanor. What exactly is this alien visitor going to do? The gods don't understand. Huh. He headed towards Goku's house. After a brief silence, Tenjin finally saw Raditz's direction. Tenjin, Mr. Bobo also changed color on his face. Give me the feeling that he came to find Goku. Tenjin said in a deep voice. Mr. Bobo did not speak. Why? What did he look for Goku for? The god cried out. Bun Mountain, Goku's home. Forget it, don't wait for Su Fan, right? Let's go to teacher Wushan first, and when Su Fan comes back, let Kichi tell him. Monkey King proposed. Okay. Bulma nodded and turned her head to look at Kiki. Kiki, aren't you going? Quote. I'm not going. Goku comes back in the evening. I'll make dinner for him and Gohan. Kiki said. Well, that's it. Sun Wukong nodded. That, let's go. Quote. Do you? Sun Wukong shouted loudly. Phew. The clouds of somersaults flew in. Bulma had also put away the capsules of the house and took out the capsules of the jet and threw them out. However, just when Sun Wukong and Bulma and Sun Wuhan were just about to leave, Sun Wukong's face changed color and turned his head to look at the sky. Snap! Raditz fell from the sky and landed directly opposite Sun Wukong. Sun Wukong was obviously able to feel the powerful aura on Raditz's body, and his face was extremely ugly when he was frightened. Who? This long-haired one. Bulma was already on the plane, and when she saw the falling Raditz, she was also stunned. Monkey King and Raditz looked at each other. Cold sweat slipped down Sun Wukong's face. Raditz, on the other hand, was much more bland. Kakarot, you've grown up, but I still recognize you at a glance, you look exactly like your father. Raditz said to the Monkey King. Sun Wukong was stunned, not understanding what he was talking about. Who are you? What are you talking about? Kiki pinched her waist and asked. Kakarot, what's going on with this planet? Your mission is to wipe out all of humanity, what have you been doing all these years? Raditz continued to ask. What Kakarot? Are you brain savvy? Kiki asked angrily, and when she said this, she also walked step by step in the direction of Raditz. Kiki. Don't go near him. Come back soon. Sun Wukong was shocked. Bang. Just when Kiki was just approaching Raditz, she saw Raditz's tail flicking gently. With a muffled sound, Kiki was pumped away by a tail. Boom. Kiki's body hit Bulma's plane hard. Suddenly, the fuselage of the aircraft was deeply dented, and the propeller fell to the ground and rolled several times. Kiki. Sun Wukong was furious, and he was about to make a move on Raditz. As for Sun Gohan, because he was too young, after seeing his mother being beaten, Fear replaced anger for a while, and he did not burst out with powerful energy. It's just that just when Sun Wukong was about to make a move, he fixed his eyes and found the tail dangling behind Raditz. What? Tail. Sun Wukong was stunned. Bulma quickly got out of the car and helped Kiki up. Fortunately, Kiki is worthy of being Goku's wife, belonging to the kind of anti-beating type, although she was hit by Raditz's tail, but it was not a big deal. You don't matter, do you? Bulma asked with concern. It's okay, Kiki gritted her teeth and glared angrily at Raditz. It's my words, I'll just hang up, Bulma's face broke out in sweat. 
Kiki, are you all right? Sun Wukong hurriedly asked. Out of the way, Goku, he dares to hit me. Fix him for me, Kiki said to Goku. I know, but didn't you find out? His tail. Sun Wukong replied. Tail. Kiki and Bulma fixed their eyes on each other, and sure enough, they saw the tail behind Raditz. The color of that tail is almost no different from the tail behind Sun Gohan. Finally noticed. Raditz smiled. Kakarot, do you remember everything? Quote. What comes to mind? What the hell are you talking about? Sun Wukong frowned and asked puzzled. What? Have you forgotten everything? Raditz was stunned for a moment and asked. I don't know what you're talking about. Sun Wukong said with a dark face, but you hit Kiki just now, I won't let you go. Quote. Did you hit your head by something and forget everything you did when you were a child? Raditz asked. I don't know. Sun Wukong shook his head. Well, since you've forgotten, I'll tell you. Raditz said coldly, Kakarot, you are a Saiyan, a Saiyan of the Fighting Nation, you were born on the planet Vegeta, when you came to Earth, your mission was to destroy all mankind. And I, your own brother, my name is Raditz. I'm here to see how well you've done the task. Quote. Sun Wukong was stunned. Bulma was stunned. Kiki was stunned. Sun Gohan's face was confused and he didn't understand. Brother. It's hard to find a relative, but it's such an eye-catching guy. Kiki huffed. Yes, this person is not a good person at first glance. Bulma nodded. Huh. Kakarot, where is your tail? Raditz suddenly discovered that Sun Wukong's tail was missing. I felt it was in the way, so I removed it. Monkey King said. What? You idiot. Tails are the source of our Saiyan strength. Raditz's nose was crooked, is it any wonder that you can get along with the humans of this planet? Hee hee, and have a child with a woman of Earth. The person I beat just now is my sister-in-law, right? Quote. Are you such a brother? Kiki crossed her waist and questioned angrily. Well, you hit Kiki, I don't want to pursue it, you go back quickly, I won't kill innocent humans. Monkey King looked at Raditz with a determined expression. Yes, Goku also saved all mankind, he will not kill. Bulma said. Yes, my name is Monkey King, not what Kakarot you said. There you go. Sun Wukong nodded. Saiyans are originally a minority and sparsely populated. Raditz snorted coldly, however, one day, a huge meteorite hit the planet Vegeta, and both of our parents died in this meteorite event. Of the remaining Saiyans today, besides you and me, there are two surviving guys left. The two of them also happened to be on a mission on an alien planet and survived. This time we came across a planet of great value, and the three of us Saiyans had a bit of a hard time attacking, so I thought of Kakarot. Quote. Monkey King. Bulma. Kiki. I noticed just now, that little guy behind you is the son of you and that earth woman, right? Raditz said with a smile. What do you want to do? Sun Wukong's face changed color. If you dare to move Gohan, I will fight with you. Kiki was furious. HMPH. Raditz smiled contemptuously and walked step by step in Gohan's direction. Stop me. Sun Wukong drank. Bang. Raditz's light punch hit Sun Wukong's chest directly. Poof. Sun Wukong spewed out a mouthful of acidic water, and the whole person fell limply to the ground. Goku. Kiki was flabbergasted. Hey, that white-faced cat, are you a Garen immortal? Bulma greeted the Garen immortals. Garen immortal. There was silence for two seconds. It's me, you're the eldest lady of the Universal Capsule Company, Bulma, right? Garen asked. Where is my boyfriend Su Fan hidden by you? Bulma did not see Sufin in the Garen Tower and had to ask. The Garen Immortal felt heartbroken. What do you call where I hid your boyfriend? What am I hiding your boyfriend for? Ahem, this little girl is really spicy enough. Garen Immortal wiped his sweat and pointed to the upper airway. Sufan seems to have gone to the temple, right on top of Garen Tower. Quote. Before the Garen Immortal could finish speaking, Bulma controlled the jet helicopter and flew in the direction of the temple. I don't know how long I flew, but Bulma finally saw the huge temple suspended in the blue sky. Bulma piloted the helicopter and landed steadily on the ground of the temple. Tenjin. Mr. Bobo. The two only looked at the situation on the ground, but did not notice that mortals would fly helicopters to appear on the temple. Hey, Tianjin, listen to that white-faced cat, is our family Su Fan here? Bulma asked directly. 
You're talking about the Garen Immortals, right? The white-faced cat, the god cried and laughed. Su Fan. Yes, it is coming. Mr. Bobo nodded and replied, he went to the room of spirit and time to cultivate, and he hasn't come out yet. Quote. To cultivate. He came here to cultivate. Bulma was stunned for a moment, and muttered in a low voice, it's really embarrassing for him, it's not like his style. Quote. Miss Bulma, you are here, asked the god. You are really leisurely, you are the god of the earth, don't you know what major events are happening below? Bulma questioned. Tenjin. We already know what happened next, Mr. Bobo said for Tenjin, I believe that Goku and Bic will defeat that man together. Quote. Bic. Bic the great devil. Did Goku join forces with him? Bulma was startled. Yes, they'll be there for brother Goku right away. Tenjin nodded, I hope the two of them can defeat that guy. Quote. Then I'm relieved. Bulma breathed a sigh of relief, to be honest, she really didn't want Su Fan to go over and die. Even Sun Wukong, the most powerful man on the earth, was put down by Sun Wukong's brother Raditz with a punch, replaced by Su Fan's words, was he not killed in seconds. Although Bulma also wants her man to get ahead, she doesn't want her man to die in vain. By the way, where is Su Fan cultivating? Bulma asked. In the room of spirit and time, just under the stairs over there, you can go in by yourself. Mr. Bobo pointed to a position in the rear left. Mr. Bobo, go and take Su Fan out, Miss Bulma can't withstand the harsh environment there. Tenjin said to Mr. Bobo. Ah, I'm really sorry, I didn't think of this level. Mr. Bobo quickly bowed and apologized, Miss Bulma, then you wait a moment, I'll go and call him out. Quote. Bulma nodded, walked to the side of the god, and followed him to look down. Only, Bulma can't see anything. Can you see Goku here? Bulma asked. I am god, I can see naturally. Tenjin nodded, they've already dealt each other. Starting so soon. What do you think? Goku and Bik teamed up, can they beat him? Bulma quickly asked. The god did not speak, and his face was a little ugly. Wouldn't you? Aren't the two of them a match for that long-haired Saiyan together? Bulma is discolored. The god still didn't speak. At the same time, Mr. Bobo took a deep breath, opened the door of spirit and time, and walked in. When Mr. Bobo went in and looked at it, he was so angry that his nose was crooked. I saw Su Fan lying on the bed and sleeping heavily. Didn't you say you were going to come in and cultivate? Hey, wake up, Su Fan, your girlfriend is looking for you. Mr. Bobo quickly stepped forward and patted Su Fan's shoulder. Su Fan was woken up by a series of power gifts. Qigong wave, 30M, learned. Dance technique, 10M, learned. Breath sensing, 50M, learned. Combat effectiveness 1030, 1030M. Dexterous dodge, 100M. Mind cultivation, 100M. God's watch, 200M. Su Fan opened his eyes and saw that it was Mr. Bobo. This black briquette's skills are really a lot. However, at present, except for the, God's watch, that is somewhat useful to Su Fan, the rest of the items, Su Fan can't use for the time being. Mr. Bobo, why did you get in? Su Fan didn't know what was happening outside, and asked curiously. Also, Mr. Bobo's combat effectiveness is indeed above 1000. But for Su Fan, it didn't matter anymore. Su Fan, your girlfriend is looking for you. Mr. Bobo said, she's just outside. Quote. Bulma. Why is she here? Su Fan was stunned, scratched his head and asked, by the way, how long has it been outside? Quote. More than five hours. Mr. Bobo said, now the form outside is not optimistic, forget it, or don't say it. Quote. What happened? Su Fan frowned, why didn't he say half of it? It's useless to tell you. Mr. Bobo replied lightly, simply put, an alien has descended on earth, and Goku and Bik are about to challenge him, and it is estimated that they have now been handed over. Quote. What? Is it the one I had a hunch about? He's coming. Su Fan jumped up from the bed at that time, but his face was excited, how is it so fast? Quote. You seem to be very happy. After Mr. Bobo said this, he fixed his eyes and saw the tail behind Su Fan, and he was stunned at that time, that, Su Fan, how do you grow a tail? Quote. Of course, it is cultivated. A faint smile appeared on Su Fan's face, you just said that they have already gone to war. Quote. 
Before Su Fan downloaded the tale, he never released it. And in the room of spirit and time, Su Fan did not need to hold his tail in his pants anymore, buttoned a hole in the back of his pants, and released his tail. Yes. Mr. Bobo nodded. Let's go. Su Fan said, sorted out his clothes, and ran outside. After coming to the temple, Su Fan saw Bulma at a glance. As if, everything was as if it was yesterday. The Bulma that Su Fan saw was still so good looking, and her figure was still so slim. For Su Fan, it has been more than two months since he saw Bulma. But for Bulma, that is, it was just separated yesterday. Oh, Su Fan, you, how do you grow a tail? Bulma hurriedly rushed up, curiously picked up Su Fan's tail, carefully examined it, and tugged hard, it's not like it's fake, how can you have a tail? Are you also a Saiyan? Quote. Su Fan smiled and gave Bulma a hug. Huh, your hair, how did your hair get longer? Head, it seems to have increased a little bit, what happened? Bulma noticed that Su Fan's appearance had changed a little. There is a room called Spirit and Time, and a day outside is equivalent to a year inside, and I stayed in it for more than two months. Su Fan explained. Huh. This way, I said how did you change so much? Bulma suddenly realized. Bulma, I'm going to save Goku, we'll talk about it when I come back. Su Fan said, slowly rising into the sky. Huh. Are you going to save Goku? Don't go. That guy is awesome. Bulma hurriedly persuaded. Don't worry. Su Fan smiled at Bulma. The heavenly god silently looked at Su Fan, revealing a strange expression, but did not speak. To give the feeling of the heavenly god, Su Fan's change is really too great. Especially the excitement and confidence on his face, it was almost the same as before. Phew. Su Fan turned into a white light and sped towards the direction where Sun Wukong, Bic and Raditz fought. The speed of the flight was so fast that the heavenly god couldn't help but be taken aback when he saw it. Hey, come back, Su Fan, Bulma shouted. However, Su Fan had already flown far. How did this kid cultivate? It impressed me. The heavenly god just glanced at Su Fan, muttered, and quickly focused his attention on Wukong's side again. Su Fan increased his flight speed, and he had to rush over to challenge Raditz. What is the purpose of cultivating for so long in the room of spirit and time? Not yet to be able to defeat Raditz. It's just, Raditz, this guy, you really didn't come at the right time. Now, Su Fan's combat effectiveness has far surpassed Raditz, and he is fully capable of killing him in seconds. In fact, Su Fan had cultivated in the room of spirit and time for about 10 days, and he had already increased his combat effectiveness to about 1500. However, Su Fan felt that it was not enough, he continued to cultivate hard inside, and in the process of cultivation, he honed his tail. Although the Saiyan tail is a source of strength, it is also a weakness. Once the tail is pinched tightly, the Saiyan will have no strength. This point, Su Fan also tried. Su Fan grabbed his tail hard, and at that time, he felt that his whole body was lying on his stomach, and he had no strength. In order to avoid this kind of thing from happening, since Su Fan downloaded the tail, he naturally had to overcome the side effects brought by the tail. Today, Su Fan's combat effectiveness has reached more than 3100, which is somewhat not high or low, and he originally wanted to cultivate in the room of spirit and time for a year, so that his combat power could reach a height of tens of thousands. However, since Raditz arrived early, Su Fan could not sit idly by. Phew. Su Fan left a white light in the sky and accelerated the speed of flight. Just as Su Fan was speeding towards Sun Wukong's side, the battle between Sun Wukong and Bic and Raditz was also the most intense moment. Fortunately, Su Fan was not very far from the position of the battle between the two sides, plus Su Fan had already increased his speed to the extreme. Soon, Su Fan appeared at the scene of the battle between the two sides. Ha ha ha, Kakarot, do you really think that just the two of you can fight your brother and me? Raditz became more and more courageous, and while saying this, his figure shook and appeared behind the two from directly opposite each other. Bang. Raditz came out with both feet and hit Sun Goku and Bic in the back on the spot. Suddenly, Sun Wukong and Bic both fell to the ground. What a terrible guy, obviously attacking in front, but ran behind him in the blink of an eye. Bike's face became more and more ugly. Abominable. 
Sun Wukong wiped the blood from the corner of his mouth. How? Kakarot, didn't I say that? You're still tender. With your little three-legged cat skill, you also want to challenge your brother. Raditz sneered, by the way, I'll tell you something by the way. Quote. Sun Wukong and Vic were both slightly stunned and pricked up their ears. Those two Saiyans are even stronger than me, and much stronger. Raditz had an endless smile on her face. Sun Wukong's face became more and more pale. Vic broke out in a cold sweat. Monkey King, did you hear that? You should be excited. Vic turned to look at the Monkey King. Ha ha, couldn't get excited at all, only fear. Sun Wukong smiled bitterly. Okay, this is the end of the game, since Kakarot you betrayed me, then I, the brother, have no reason to keep you. In Raditz's evil eyes, a thick killing intent emerged. Beep. Just when Raditz was about to use a killing move against Sun Wukong and Bike, the detector he wore on his eyes suddenly appeared a combat warning response. Combat Power 3121. After Raditz saw the combat power value above, his eyes widened at that time, and shock and panic appeared in his pupils. Who is it? Is the detector malfunctioning? Raditz was so frightened that his body trembled slightly. Snap. Raditz looked up and was surprised to find a person suspended in the sky. This person has a handsome appearance, wears an orange suit similar to Kakarot, and has a scar on his face. Exactly Su Fan. Ah. Su Fan fell from the sky and landed directly opposite Raditz. Su Fan. What are you doing here? The Monkey King is also a little surprised. Goku, do you remember what I said last night? Su Fan said. Remember, you said that there might be a terrible opponent descending on Earth, but I didn't expect it to really hit you. Sun Wukong's eyes flickered, ha ha, your hunch is very correct. Quote. This, 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 who is this guy? Raditz looked at Su Fan with a shocked expression, his face full of vigilance and unease. Huh. How did Sun Wukong's brother show a look of fear after seeing this person? Bik was more attentive, and when he saw the change in Raditz's expression, he was a little puzzled. Immediately afterwards, Bik looked at Su Fan carefully. I've seen this person, why don't I remember what kind of powerful character he is? Bik was even more confused in his heart. Tail. You have a tail too. Raditz finally noticed the tail behind Su Fan, just now he was only concerned about Su Fan's combat strength, and he had not seen the tail yet. Hearing Raditz say this, Sun Wukong and Bik also immediately looked behind Su Fan. Tail. Su Fan, why did you grow a tail? Sun Wukong asked in surprise. Are you Saiyan too? Raditz asked in surprise. What do you say? Su Fan smiled. This can't be. The Saiyans have no surviving existence except for me and Kakarot, and my two companions, Vegeta and Nava. Raditz gritted his teeth. Oh, you think so? Su Fan smiled and said lightly, it doesn't hurt to tell you, my ancestors came to Earth before the Saiyans left the planet Shirata. Quote. What? Planet Shirata. Is that, that was before planet Vegeta. Raditz was shocked and his eyes widened. The reason why Su Fan said this was also to give himself a new identity. After all, he suddenly became a Saiyan, and it was strange to say it. Huh. Su Fan, are you a Saiyan? How did I not know? Sun Wukong also asked in surprise. Goku, I also recently remembered these sealed memories. Su Fan replied with a smile. Remembered. It is said that a Saiyan named Amoxi left the planet Shirata a long time ago, could it be that he came to Earth? Are you a descendant of Amoshi? Raditz's pupils shrank sharply and looked at Su Fan without blinking. Oh. You got it. Su Fan smiled slightly. Beep. Raditz was slightly stunned, and then saw that Su Fan's combat power did not know when, it had already become about 300. Yes, it must be a malfunction detector. Just now, there was a guy with more than 700 people on the probe, and that little guy was actually Kakarot's son. Detector, how do you drop the chain at a critical moment? At the same time, Raditz seemed to remember that Emoshi was too far away from his own era even if he was the most brilliant person in the past, but after so many years of washing, the person named Su Fan in front of him was already the kind of mixed Saiyan who could not be more. After a moment of shock, Raditz's face gradually returned to normal, and he took a deep breath. HMPH, since you are also a Saiyan, how about I sincerely invite you to join me on an alien expedition? Raditz invited first. Not interested. 
Su Fan replied lightly. What? Are you not interested? Raditz's face was a little unpleasant. So, you, like Kakarot, are planning to betray us. Quote. The word betrayal annoys me when I say it. Su Fan sneered. Ah. Just for a moment, Su Fan appeared directly opposite Raditz, so fast that neither Sun Wukong nor Vic who was present reacted. What? Raditz's eyes widened, and his expression was full of stunnedness. Snap. Su Fan slapped Raditz's face, leaving five bright red fingerprints on Raditz's face at that time. Bang. Raditz flew straight out upside down and fell heavily to the ground. Sun Wukong was dumbfounded. Vic was dumbfounded. This Saiyan Raditz, who moved them to fear, was actually slapped away by Su Fan. How did he do it? This, 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 how is this possible? Raditz covered her reddened cheeks, her expression full of puzzlement and dazedness. Because, Raditz looked at the detector carefully and found that on the detector, Su Fan's combat strength value was still around 300. Su Fan stepped forward, grabbed Raditz's collar, and slipped up from the ground. Say, you won't come to Earth again in the future. Su Fan shouted coldly. Too much deception, I won't lose to you. Raditz aimed his hand at Su Fan's chest. Boom. The flame of light in Raditz's hand bloomed, and it hit Su Fan's chest at that time. Snap. It seemed that the imposing energy bomb, after contact with Su Fan's body, was easily blown away by the breath released by Su Fan. What? This, 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 that's impossible. Raditz was shocked. He he he, he took the blow of that guy head on. Actually, actually, Vic also widened his eyes, and cold sweat broke out on his face. That's awesome. Su Fan, it's amazing. Sun Wukong was even more surprised. Is this still the person he knew who used to be called Leping? It seems that you don't want to say it. Su Fan sneered. Snap. Syllable. Quote. Su Fan slapped Raditz in the face twice. Suddenly, blood oozed from the corners of Raditz's mouth, and endless fear appeared in his pupils. Temple. Tenjin. Mr. Bobo. This, 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 when did he become so powerful? Tenjin asked in surprise. Coming out of that room, I felt a little different about him. Mr. Bobo mused. Hey, how's it going? Did Goku and Vic team up to defeat that Saiyan? Bulma hurriedly asked, who did you say just now? Quote. Tenjin and Mr. Bobo turned to look at Bulma. Both of them wanted to ask, as Su Fan's pillow person, don't you know how powerful your man is? What do you see me doing? Bulma glared, and then said indifferently, forget it, I'd better hurry up and call Klin and them to help, Su Fan's little ability, I'm afraid it will be dangerous if I go. Quote. Su Fan shouldn't be in danger, said the heavenly god. HMPH, it's not your boyfriend again, of course you don't care. Really. Bulma snorted coldly, immediately piloted the jet, and left the temple in a huff. Battle scene. Since you don't want to say it, then I'll kill you. Su Fan smiled. I said. I say. Raditz was startled at that time, and hurriedly said, I will never come to Earth again, you let me go, I will leave immediately, go far. Quote. Seriously. Su Fan looked at Raditz with a smile. That's true. Raditz immediately nodded with a chicken pecking rice. Quote dot quote. Su Fan flew up and kicked on Raditz's body. Poof. Raditz spewed out a mouthful of acid, feeling that the whole person was not good. I'm leaving, I'm leaving, Raditz croaked, walking step by step in the direction of the spaceship. The reason why Su Fan did not kill Raditz immediately was also to hope that Goku would die such a time because of this. If Sun Wukong didn't die, he wouldn't be able to see the king of the realm, he wouldn't be able to fist the king of the realm, let alone the Yuan Chi bullet. If Sun Wukong doesn't, where will Su Fan download these two abilities? You can't die by yourself and go to the King of Realms to study again, right? Su Fan can't afford to die, Bulma is still waiting for her at home. Moreover, Su Fan believes that after experiencing this death, Sun Wukong has become more mature, which also provides a solid foundation for Sun Wukong's future growth. Both Monkey King and Vic were dumbfounded. Such a powerful opponent was actually instigated by Su Fan. Sun Wukong suddenly remembered that he had to fight with Su Fan before. Thinking about it now, if Su Fan really wanted to fight with himself at that time, wouldn't he be looking for abuse? According to Su Fan's newly written script, 
Raditz happened to pass by the location where Sun Wukong was when he walked in the direction of the spaceship. Raditz glanced at the Monkey King. Ah! Raditz's eyes narrowed slightly, and his figure shook, and immediately appeared behind Sun Wukong. Snap! Raditz grabbed Sun Wukong's hair and controlled Sun Wukong in his hands. Don't move, it's better not to move. If you dare to move, I will kill him. Raditz shouted at Su Fan. How? Isn't the lesson enough? Su Fan's eyes narrowed. Kakarot is my brother, you can not go, but today I will take him away if I say anything. Raditz said with a dark face. Su Fan walked towards Raditz step by step. Stop. If you dare to step forward again, I will kill him. Raditz shouted angrily, I know your speed is fast, but I have condensed energy in my hands, as long as you dare to appear behind me, I don't mind killing Kakarot immediately. Quote. Su Fan stopped. Even if you want to borrow Raditz's hand to let Sun Wukong go to the Realm King to cultivate, it can't be so obvious, right? Okay, that's it, stand where you are and don't move. Raditz sneered, I really didn't expect that the Saiyans would actually become flesh and blood. Quote. After saying this, Raditz controlled the Monkey King to the vicinity of the spaceship. In front of Raditz, the current strength of Sun Wukong is too low to resist at all. Snap. Raditz opened the hatch of the spherical spaceship, casually pulled out the crying Sun Gohan, and kicked him to the ground. Sun Gohan, who was only four years old, fainted at that time. Gohan. Sun Wukong cared about his son and shouted loudly. My brother, you better take good care of yourself. Raditz smiled softly and dragged Monkey King into the spaceship. Although this spaceship is small, it can barely fit two people. Snap. The spaceship hatch closes. Hey, just let him go. Vic asked loudly to Su Fan. How else? Su Fan turned his head and asked. Vic was speechless. Don't worry, we can use Dragon Ball to bring Monkey King back. Su Fan smiled. That's a good idea. Vic nodded and croaked again, but just let this guy go. Quote. He'll always come again. Su Fan said lightly, I won't spare him lightly next time. Quote. Phew. The spaceship soared into the sky and fled into the starry sky. In the spaceship. Abominable. That Saiyan named Sufan. Raditz wiped the blood from the corner of his mouth, clenched his fists, and then said to Goku in a cold voice, Kakarot, then you and I can enjoy space travel. Quote. I will not kill innocent people with you. Sun Wukong said with a firm expression. HMPH, I'm afraid this is not up to you. Raditz smiled. What if I break this spaceship? Sun Wukong grinned. What did you say? Raditz was shocked. Idiot, this is space, you broke the spaceship, you have to die. Quote. Then I will die with you. Monkey King smiled. Ten seconds later. Boom. Above the distant starry sky. The spacecraft made a popping sound, and the sky bloomed with bright red colors. Losing the spaceship, Sun Wukong and Raditz, who were in space, quickly turned into an ice sculpture. 30 seconds later. Bang. Bang. Quote. Two people with burning flames from high in the air, fell down quickly, and near Sufin and Bike, they smashed a large pit and raised a large piece of dust. What? What happened? Vic was startled and rushed forward. Su Fan didn't understand what was happening, and quickly flew over. Subsequently, Su Fan saw Sun Wukong and Raditz lying on the ground. It has to be said that the vitality of the Saiyans is still very tenacious. Previously, they were frozen into ice sculptures in space, and as they fell, the ice gradually melted. The two did not die, but their bones were shattered because they fell from space. Raditz wanted to use the dancing technique, but unfortunately, he was frozen into an ice sculpture before and lost consciousness. It can be said that both Monkey King and Raditz were woken up by falling. At this time, although the two were still alive, they were already dying. The immortal beans on Su Fan's body have already been used up, and naturally he can't save Wukong anymore. However, Su Fan then thought that Wukong would be sent by the Heavenly God to the planet of the Realm King to cultivate next, so as to learn the Realm King Fist and the Yuan Chi Bullet, which was also a good choice for him. In fact, Su Fan is somewhat selfish, as long as Wukong learns the Realm King Fist, then he can download it. Goku, what happened? Su Fan walked to Sun Wukong's side. Ahem, I broke the spaceship. Monkey King coughed. Why are you suffering? I was going to get you back through Dragon Balls. 
Su Fan didn't expect Sun Wukong to make this move, but it saved some trouble. Originally, Su Fan was still thinking that if Sun Wukong was really taken hostage, it could only mean that his life should not be extinguished. In this regard, Su Fan will no longer let Sun Wu sacrifice in vain. Huh. You didn't say earlier, but I can't do it anymore. Sun Wukong didn't know what to say, and then looked at Su Fan and said, Please, please help me take care of Gohan. Quote. Don't worry, I will entrust it to a reliable person. Su Fan thought about it and nodded slightly. HMPH, Kakarot, you idiot, why are you suffering? He actually sacrificed his own life. Raditz had not yet lost his breath, and said hatefully while spraying blood. You are wrong, Sun Wukong will be resurrected soon. Vic glanced at Su Fan, then at Raditz, and said lightly, On our planet, there is a magical thing called Dragon Ball, which can grant any wish, and Sun Wukong's companion will resurrect Sun Wukong. Quote. What? And does this kind of thing exist? Raditz's eyes widened, and a shallow smile appeared at the corner of his mouth. HMPH, you guys made a mistake. I told my companion through the detector about everything that happened here. When the time comes, my companion will come to collect the Dragon Balls and then revive me. Quote. Vic. Your companion, when will the other two more powerful Saiyans come? Monkey King asked. One year, a year later. Raditz snorted coldly. You don't know the strength of the Saiyans, even if you can defeat me, but compared to my companions, you are just a small ant, they can easily pinch you to death. When the time comes, enjoy the fun of hell. Quote. Bang. Vic was furious, slapped a paw over, and hit Raditz's neck, instantly killing Raditz. One year, a year later, two more powerful Saiyans, Sun Wukong's eyes were a little expectant and uneasy, I will work hard, I want to surpass you and surpass them. Quote. Immediately afterwards, Sun Wukong looked at Su Fan with difficulty, and pointed in the direction of Sun Wuhan. Don't worry Goku, Vic will take good care of Gohan, he must be an excellent teacher. Su Fan said to Sun Wukong. Vic. The reason why he said this, Su Fan felt that if he took Sun Gohan away, Vic's growth route would inevitably change a lot, and he would still travel in the direction of evil in the future. The reason why Vic will become a good person in the future is also because of the influence of Sun Gohan. Sun Wukong's eyes widened, and he didn't know what to say for a while. Vic also looked stunned. Why let me take care of that little ghost? Just before fighting Raditz, Vic heard Sun Gohan, the little ghost, crying all the time. Su Fan, when I am resurrected, I will cultivate well. I want to surpass you. Sun Wukong smiled at Su Fan and took his last breath. Ah. The next moment, Sun Wukong's body disappeared all of a sudden. HMPH, it must be that guy from Tenjin, I don't know what to do with Sun Wukong. Vic looked at it and muttered to himself faintly. Su Fan naturally knew that Sun Wukong had gone to the Yin Saudi mansion, and would go to the planet of the Realm King through the Snake Road. Su Fan glanced at Vic lightly. You can go, take Goku's son Gohan by the way, and hone him well, he will definitely help. Su Fan said. HMPH, what's the use of that little ghost who only knows how to cry? Vic said coldly. Because of Su Fan's arrival, Sun Gohan did not exert the power of anger, so Vic did not intend to train Gohan. Trust me, he's strong. Su Fan said to Bike. After a short silence, Vic finally obediently stepped forward and clamped the sleepy Sun Gohan by his arm. Immediately afterwards, Vic glanced at Su Fan with some jealousy, and then flew into the sky and quickly left the scene. Not long after Vic left, a jet helicopter appeared in the sky. Inside the helicopter, it was Bulma. Bulma has brought the turtle immortal and Klin and Kiki over. At this moment, everyone in the helicopter was a little dazed for a while after seeing the situation at the scene. I still can't believe that Goku is an alien. Klin muttered. Actually, I've seen Goku a little unusual for a long time. The turtle immortal laughed. Just Su Fan and the Saiyan lying on the ground, Goku and the Vic man. Bulma muttered. So, was that Saiyan killed by Vic and Goku? Klin breathed a sigh of relief, I'll just say, Goku will have a way. Quote. Bulma no longer hesitated, immediately controlled the helicopter, and landed steadily near Su Fan. After getting off the helicopter, Bulma quickly ran towards Su Fan. Su Fan, it's good if you're okay, what happened? Bulma quickly asked. 
It's a pity that Goku and Raditz have died together. Su Fan didn't explain much. Huh. After hearing these words, everyone's eyes widened, and their expressions were full of shock. Bulma and the others were silent for a while. But don't worry, Goku can be resurrected through Dragon Ball, and his body has been taken away by the gods in order to welcome two more powerful Saiyans in a year. Su Fan said. Hearing Su Fan say this, the dead atmosphere of the scene was finally solved. Yes, the Monkey King can be resurrected through Dragon Ball. Moreover, Tenjin took Goku away and should have his purpose. A year later, two more powerful Saiyans. The face of the turtle immortal changed color slightly. Goku was taken away by the gods. That's great. Then I was relieved. Klin breathed a sigh of relief, but then again, Leping, you seem to have changed a lot. Quote. My name is Su Fan, you remember wrong, Klin. Su Fan smiled. Wouldn't you? How could I misremember your name? Klin scratched his head and asked Bulma, Bulma, is his name Leping? Quote. His name is Su Fan, you really remember wrong. Bulma replied. Uh, that's weird. Klin was confused. Old turtle, what do you think? Bulma turned to look at the turtle immortal and glared at him. Haha, ha, it's called Su Fan, and I also remember it's called Su Fan. The turtle immortal laughed. Su Fan, where is Gohan? Tears welled up in Kiki's eyes, her body trembled slightly, and she asked a little nervously. Gohan was taken by Vic to cultivate. Su Fan said. Kiki's white eyes rolled and she fainted to the ground. What do you say? Was Gohan really taken away by bike? Why not stop him, Su Fan? Bulma looked at Su Fan and asked. Everyone present believed that it was Sun Gohan that Vic forcibly took away. No one knew that it was Su Fan who asked Vic to take Gohan away. Not waiting for Su Fan to speak. Miss Bulma, Su Fan wants to stop him, but he is no match for the great demon king of bike. Klin smiled on the side and said. That's what I said, Bulma nodded, I'll be relieved that you're okay. Quote. But Su Fan, how did you learn to grow a tail like Goku? Is it a fake tail installed behind him? You wouldn't be a Saiyan too, would you? Klin asked curiously. Okay, let's stop the small talk. The two Saiyans in a year are very powerful. We must cultivate well and strive to defeat them. Su Fan didn't say too much nonsense, but said seriously. Klin nodded solemnly. It is said that this Goku's brother is very powerful, and even Goku is not his opponent. Well, a year later, those two Saiyans arrived, and Klin felt terrible to think about. By the way, Su Fan, I remember how did Sun Wukong's brother find Wukong when he came here. Bulma asked curiously. He has a detector on his eye that can detect combat effectiveness values. Su Fan pointed to the detector in Raditz's eye. Detector. Bulma leaned closer to take a look. Su Fan stepped forward and directly took off the probe and handed it to Bulma. Well, let me go back to research and research, maybe I can find Tianjin Rice and them, so that there can be more people against the Saiyans in a year. Bulma simply pressed a few buttons of the detector and whispered. In this case, let's go back to the Turtle Immortal House first. Su Fan proposed. Everyone did not object, and immediately took Bulma's helicopter and flew towards the direction of the Kamezin house. On the way, Kiki wakes up once, but the thought of the fact that Gohan was taken away by the great demon King Vic makes her eyes roll again. After returning to the Turtle Fairy house, Bulma began to study the detector. Su Fan sat on the beach outside the Turtle House and downloaded the skills of the Turtle Immortals. The Turtle Immortals have a lot of skills, but Su Fan can't download them all. The only thing that made Su Fan look at was the Demon Seal Wave of the Turtle Immortal. The size of the Magic Seal Wave is 100M, and with Su Fan's current network speed, it takes two hours to download. Fortunately, the small island where the Turtle Immortal House is located has a radius of about 30 meters. Su Fan's current location just won't let the Turtle Immortal be more than 10 meters away. Two hours later, Su Fan successfully downloaded the Magic Seal Wave. After getting the relevant information of the Demon Seal Wave, Su Fan found that this thing was indeed very energy consuming. But fortunately, with Su Fan's current strength, he can successfully use the Demon Seal Wave. It's just that this thing has to be practiced diligently, otherwise once it is crooked when sealing, the next time you use the same trick on the enemy, the other party will not be easy to be fooled. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. What is it? Su Fan was stunned. 
because Su Fan was surprised to find that his reputation value did not know when it changed from zero to two. By the way, he must have defeated Raditz, and his reputation value changed, right? Yes, it must be. It is worth mentioning that Su Fan also saw that on the prestige value, several lines of remarks appeared. Prestige, upgradable internet speed. 3G speed, download speed 120k, s 600k, s 10 reputation points required. 4G network speed, download speed 1.5m, s 10m, s 100 reputation points required. 5G network speed, download speed 100m, s 1000 reputation points required. 6G speed, download speed 1G, s 10,000 reputation points required. When he saw the speed of the internet that appeared above, Su Fan's eyes straightened. Your sister, the 5G network speed has reached 100 m per second. It's special. Similar to the Saiyan inheritance or something, it only takes 3 seconds to download it. Su Fan thought of his tortoise speed download before, and felt a little sad. A distant starry sky, some unknown planet. Vegeta is sitting on the head of an octopus, nibbling on octopus paws in his hand. Raditz is dead. Naba said flatly. That poor guy was abused by a guy with a combat power of a little more than 3,000. Vegeta took a bite of octopus meat and said contemptuously. Vegeta, is that man named Sufin really a descendant of a Mosi? Naba asked. I don't know, maybe. Vegeta smiled. If it is really a descendant of a Moshi, it will be difficult to deal with. Naba was a little worried. HMPH, even if it is the descendant of a Moshi, after these hundreds of years of washing, the primeval bloodline on his body has long been diluted. Vegeta was surprised, besides, his combat power is only a little more than 3000, I believe you can destroy him without my attack. Quote. Yes, I was almost scared by him. Nabahaha smiled. What interests me the most right now is the Dragon Ball they mentioned. Vegeta casually dropped the octopus claw, wiped his mouth, got up and said, let's go, go to Earth. Quote. Vegeta, shall we go find the Dragon Ball that can grant any wish? Are we going to revive Raditz? Naba asked. What's the use of resurrecting that idiot? Why not let the Dragon Ball give us permanent life so that we can fight forever? Vegeta smiled. Well, that's a good wish. Naba nodded. Hurrah. Two Saiyan spaceships cut two arcs in the sky and retreated into the starry sky. Earth, Turtle House. After more than three hours of modification, Bulma finally modified the detector. Grandpa Turtle over there, come here. Bulma beckoned to the Turtle Immortal and pressed the detector she was wearing on her eyes. Grandpa Turtle, the Turtle Immortal was speechless at this title. However, the Turtle Immortal still walked forward very obediently. What for? The Turtle Immortal asked puzzled. I transformed the detector into a number symbol that I could understand, well, 139, the combat strength value of Wushan teacher. Bulma said. Wow, that's amazing, 139. Even this can be measured. The turtle immortal was surprised. Bulma, quickly see what my combat power is. Klin hurriedly greeted. Klin's combat effectiveness, wow, 206. Bulma said in surprise. 206. Haha, ha, so to speak, have I already surpassed teacher Wushan. Klin was pleasantly surprised. Is this thing reliable? The turtle immortal scratched his head, his face depressed. The most powerful thing about this detector is that it can show the specific location of the people with high combat power in this world, and the Saiyans are really smart. Bulma mused, then pointed in another direction. Over there, there's a 250 over there. Quote. 250, the turtle immortal was speechless for a while. It's Tianjin Rice, right? Yes, it must be him. Klin replied affirmatively. Beep. Wow, 329. It's so strong. Who is it? Bulma's face changed color slightly, and cold sweat slipped down her delicate face. It must be Vic. The turtle immortal nodded. So, Goku's son must be by his side. Klin guessed, then asked, let's go get Goku's son back. Quote. No, Vic must have a reason for doing this. The turtle immortal shook his head, besides, we are not his opponents. Quote. Combat effectiveness 329. We will be killed. Klin snorted, his face pale for a moment in fright. Beep. At this moment, Bulma's detector once again appeared a signal response. 
Combat Power 3121. Who is it? Bulma exclaimed in fright. What? Klin's eyes were about to jump out of his sockets, and his face turned pale. 3121. Are you kidding? The turtle immortal also widened his eyes, his face was incredulous, and he thought that he had heard it wrong. Just in, right outside, less than 10 meters away. Bulma's body began to tremble. What? Klin and the turtle immortal were shocked and quickly ran outside. Klin, turtle immortal, and Bulma rushed to the door to take a look, and were surprised to find Su Fan sitting cross knee outside. Ha ha ha, Bulma, what are you kidding? The combat power 3121 you said will not be Su Fan, right? Klin laughed, thinking it was so funny. Klin knows more about the previous leping, in Klin's opinion, Su Fan's combat effectiveness is not as good as his own, and it is estimated that it is very remarkable to have a 170 or so. How could Su Fan's combat effectiveness reach more than 3000? Huh. How did the combat effectiveness become 156 again? Bulma was stunned for a moment, looked at the value on the detector, and was a little puzzled. It can't be a malfunction, right? Klin asked. Quite possibly, it is estimated that there is a problem with a part. Bulma nodded. Are you testing combat effectiveness? Su Fan smiled slightly and calmly got up. Yes, Su Fan, just now Bulma detected your combat strength, and it has reached more than 3,000. Klin said. Is it? It's just over 3,000, too little. Su Fan shook his head. Su Fan, do you know what you're talking about? Do you say less combat effectiveness of 3,000? Klin crossed his waist and laughed, I heard that Goku's brother Raditz's combat power seems to be about 1500. And Goku's combat power is only a little more than 400, and Bix's combat power is more than 300, the two joined forces, Goku sacrificed his life, and finally killed Raditz. If you have 3000 combat power, it is easy to kill Goku's brother in seconds. Quote. In the eyes of Klin and others, it must be Sun Wukong and Bix who joined forces to defeat Raditz. In this regard, Su Fan just laughed. Ha ha, ha ha, Su Fan, you can really joke. Klin stepped forward and patted Su Fan's shoulder. Su Fan smiled and didn't explain much. Su Fan knew that he was not enough. Only a little more than 3000 combat strength, is not a capital to be proud of, let alone Vegeta who appeared a year later, that is, Vegeta's younger brother Naba, Su Fan is still not an opponent. Su Fan must make himself stronger, must surpass Vegeta, surpass Frieza. But Su Fan, let's cheer together, in a year, let's fight side by side. Klin said with a solemn expression. Hem. Su Fan nodded. In the room, Bulma went back and disassembled the parts of the detector and looked at it carefully. Strange, there is nothing wrong with the detector, Bulma studied for a long time, but still did not find any fault in the detector, and was a little puzzled for a while. What's wrong? Bulma. The turtle couldn't help but ask when he saw Bulma's confused look. The detector is fine, but why did it just show that Su Fan's combat power is 3,121? Bulma held her chin and groaned. Wouldn't you? The turtles were surprised. Outside. Someone is coming. The turtle immortal looked up into the distance of the sea. Who is it? Klin was stunned for a moment. Su Fan also looked into the distance. Not long after, a yacht appeared on the shore. Exactly Archie Loeb. You're the duck chicken radish at Garen Immortals, right? Klin asked. It's Archie Loeb. Akirobe shouted angrily, you did it on purpose, right? Quote. Hey, hey. Klin scratched his head. It's hard to find a house in a place like this. Yakilob said his intentions, I came to send a message to the Garen Immortals, he understands the situation here, he told you, Su Fan, Tianjin Rice and Dumplings, go to Garen Tower immediately. Quote. Huh. Everyone goes to Garinta. Quote. The gods will train you personally. Akilob added, reluctantly, and me. Quote. Really. Klin was a little surprised. Yes, I told him, I don't want to mess with that alien, but, it's useless, Archirobe looked upset. I know, I'll call everyone over. Klin nodded. By the way, there is one more thing, the Garen immortal told him not to revive Goku until the enemy comes. Archie Loeb continued. Huh. Why? Klin and the others were puzzled. Goku is going to cultivate in the netherworld. Archie Loeb replied. What? Cultivating in Hades. Klin was surprised. 
In the next few days, Su Fan first helped everyone get together the Dragon Balls. Even if he wanted to cultivate, Su Fan was not bad for these two or three days. Subsequently, under the leadership of the Garen Immortals, Su Fan and the others stepped on the Temple of the Earth together. Su Fan didn't want to come, but he thought that Mr. Bobo's, God's Watch, had not been downloaded, so he had to go for a trip. Moreover, Su Fan suddenly thought that there should be a lot of good things on the body of the Heavenly God. For example, the ability of Nemesis to regenerate. Thinking of this, Su Fan was looking forward to it. Before leaving, Bulma threw herself into Su Fan's arms. Su Fan, I'm waiting for you below, after a year, you must survive. Bulma raised her head and stared at Su Fan. Su Fan nodded solemnly. Three days later, Su Fan stepped into the Temple of the Earth again. It didn't take long for Tianjin Rice and Dumplings to also come here. Tianjin Fan was also shocked when he learned the news of Goku's death. You are all the most powerful humans on Earth, and in a year, two more powerful Saiyans will come to Earth, I won't say much more, I hope you cultivate well and defeat them. When the Heavenly God said this, he took a deep look at Su Fan. Yes. God. Klin and the others quickly answered. Mr. Bobo, it's hard work for you next. Tenjin said to Mr. Bobo. Mr. Bobo bowed slightly. Mr. Bobo will train you for the next while. The heavenly god continued, beckoning to Su Fan, Su Fan, come on. Quote. Okay. Su Fan followed. Strange, why let Su Fan leave alone? Klin muttered softly. Isn't Su Fan at the scene of the battle? Tenjin wants to know more, right? Tenjin Fan guessed. Yes, too. Klin didn't suspect anything more. The heavenly god took Su Fan to a place where there was no one and looked at him with a solemn expression. You know all about it. Su Fan asked with a flat expression. Yes, I have seen it all, your strength impresses me, and it is almost the same as five years ago. Tenjin smiled. It's not enough. Su Fan shook his head slightly. You mean to say that those two Saiyans who appeared a year later are even stronger than you? Tenjin asked in surprise. Originally, the heavenly god called Su Fan over alone, just to ask if he was sure of defeating those two Saiyans in a year. Unexpectedly, he hadn't asked yet, but Su Fan had already answered. Yes, so I have to surpass them, far beyond them. Su Fan nodded. Come on. Tianjin's eyes were full of expectation, I believe that Wukong is over there, and he will also cultivate well, and in a year, it will be up to you too. Quote. There are still many things I have to learn, and I will stay and practice well. Su Fan replied. Not arrogant and impatient, success is not living. The heavenly god patted Su Fan's shoulder and said approvingly, I believe that Su Fan's future achievements must be limitless. Quote. In the following days, Mr. Bobo explained to Su Fan and others how to use Qi, how to attack and defend. After Su Fan heard it, he also gained a little bit. Not to mention, although some skills can be downloaded, but Mr. Bobo explained it again, and Su Fan could understand it more thoroughly. At the same time, the Heavenly God's gift package also appeared in Su Fan's Sea of Knowledge. It is worthy of being the God of the Earth. There are a lot of things that can be downloaded on my body. After Su Fan saw it, he was a little excited. Among them, what interested Su Fan the most were two things. One is the ability to regenerate limbs, which is 300m in size, and at the current internet speed, it takes 6 hours to download it like the Saiyan heritage. Su Fan's guess was correct, sure enough, as a celestial god of the Nemesis people, his body had the ability to regenerate. Limb regeneration. In the future, if he lacks arms and legs, Su Fan can grow directly through the ability to regenerate. Moreover, it seems that the nemesis can regenerate limbs as long as the head is not seriously injured. There is another thing worth downloading that Su Fan is optimistic about. That's psychic. This psychic, the system also added notes for ease of understanding. Psychic. 200M, you can walk around the netherworld, but you can't stay for a long time. As for the phrase, do not stay for a long time, the system does not say exactly how long. So, as long as he downloaded the psychic, Su Fan could enter the Yin Saudi mansion. Then, can Su Fan go to the planet of the Realm King? Su Fan felt a little excitement in his heart. Su Fan was still thinking about how to download Sun Wukong's Realm King Fist. Now, with the channeling of the Heavenly God, he
he can go to the planet of the Realm King through the Yin Saudi mansion. It's just that the Long Snake Road is extremely long, and Su Fan decided to improve his strength again. In addition to these two skills, there are several skills that Su Fan also likes. For example, Magic Clothes 10M. This Magic Clothes seem to be able to conjure up a brand new dress for yourself, and there is no other use in addition, no wonder it is only 10M in size. But for Su Fan, this magic dress seems to be a little. Su Fan couldn't help but think of Bulma. If you cast a, magic dress, on Bulma, Su Fan was a little excited when he thought about it. In addition to the, magic clothes, there is also, God's watch, which is the same as Mr. Bobo's. Of course, Tenjin also has a magic seal wave to download. However, Su Fan has already downloaded and learned the magic sealing wave, but he can't use it. There is also a skill, Su Fan thought that it should also be downloaded. That is, body borrowing, size 100m. This skill is a bit similar to the, seizure, of Shushan novels, but it is not entirely correct. The ability of, body borrowing, Tianjin once used, that is, at the 22nd Tianxia First Martial Arts Conference, Tianxian borrowed a mortal body to participate in the competition. It seems that this body borrowing is to allow one's body and soul to wear to someone's body. Su Fan didn't have anything to hesitate and decided to download all these skills. At least, in the near future, Su Fan will stay in the temple, but it is convenient to download. Moreover, Su Fan also observed that the place where the heavenly god lived was not very far from his bedroom, and it was much more convenient to download. Six days later. Su Fan finally used the 2G network speed to successfully download many abilities from the Heavenly God. Body regeneration, psychic, magical clothes, body borrowing, now Su Fan has completely mastered. Of course, in this process, Su Fan's download was also interrupted once, but the last thing Su Fan lacked was patience. In the end, Su Fan took all these special abilities for himself. Very good, you have successfully mastered the theoretical knowledge, and everyone has a different understanding. Mr. Bobo said with satisfaction, the best way to cultivate is to fight, so let's have a small competition meeting, and we will compete with each other, and we will have a higher improvement in our own cultivation. Quote. Talk. Ha ha, I like this more. Klin laughed. Tianjin Rice has a confident smile on the corner of his mouth. Dumplings also nodded vigorously. Archirobe looked depressed and seemed to have no interest in the battle. Su Fan's expression was indifferent. Not to mention, after the combination of theory and reality in these six days, as well as the running in period after coming out of the spirit and time room, Su Fan's combat effectiveness has improved a little bit. Now Su Fan's combat effectiveness has reached 3633. Of course, Su Fan could not be satisfied with the status quo. The combat effectiveness of 3633 still can't beat Naba and Vegeta. Su Fan remembered that Vegeta's combat effectiveness during this period had reached a height of 18,000. Su Fan felt that there was really not much time left for himself. Moreover, Su Fan admitted that he was not a genius type warrior. Su Fan is just an earthling with mediocre qualifications, inheriting the bloodline of the Saiyans. I don't know if a year later, I can surpass Vegeta in my combat effectiveness. Su Fan, will you show them first? Mr. Bobo greeted Su Fan politely, he also knew that Su Fan was very powerful. The reason why Su Fan made a move was also to inspire and motivate Klin and others. Me. Su Fan came back to his senses. Ha ha ha, Su Fan, I will be merciful. Tianjin Rice said with a smile. Don't make trouble, you are not my opponent. Su Fan glanced at Tianjin Rice lightly. What do you say? Have you forgotten how you were abused by me at the world's first martial arts conference? Tianjin Rice was smiling. That's me letting you. Su Fan's expression was indifferent. Oh. So, your strength has surpassed mine. Tianjin Fan suddenly became interested, and looked at Su Fan with a smile, or. Now let's try it out. Quote. Since you want to find abuse, I will fulfill you. Su Fan smiled. Immediately afterwards, Su Fan slowly pulled out a black cloth strip from his body. Tianjin Fan was stunned. Klin was also confused. Archie Loeb glanced at this side curiously. Brother Tian, the dumpling called symbolically. Ahem, Su Fan, you black strip, are you planning to use it as a weapon? 
Clin asked with a wry smile. Clin, you think too much. Su Fan smiled and shoved the black cloth strip over his eyes. Clin. Dumplings. Archie Loeb. Tianjin Rice. After a short silence, Tianjin Rice was furious. How much do you have to look down on people? Actually hit me blindfolded. Just when Tianjin Fan was a little annoyed, something that made him even more angry happened. I saw that Su Fan's left hand was placed behind him, and he just stretched out his right hand. At the same time, Su Fan also took a horse step. Well, whatever you want to attack, if I move my footsteps, count me as losing. Su Fan's face was filled with endless confidence. It's not that Su Fan is big, Su Fan also wants to judge the opponent's position with the slight vibration of the air in this way. This guy is simply unsightly. Tianjin Rice croaked his teeth, and the breath on his body also suddenly rose. The combat effectiveness of Tianjin Rice in this period was only a little more than 250, which was too much different compared with Su Fan. Phew. Tianjin Fan rushed towards Su Fan's direction quickly. Bang bang. Tianjin Fan launched a fierce attack on Su Fan. Looking at Su Fan again, he just stretched out a finger and easily blocked Tianjin Fan's attack. When they saw such an amazing scene, everyone was shocked. What? When did this guy Su Fan become so powerful? Clint's eyes widened and he looked shocked. How is this possible? Tianjin Rice was also more and more surprised. Bang! Su Fan slapped it over, and hit Tianjin Fan's chest at that time. Poof! Tianjin Rice flew out upside down at that time, and spewed out a mouthful of blood, and then fell heavily to the ground. Brother Tian! The dumplings hurriedly rushed up and helped Tianjin Rice up. Su Fan slowly took off the black cloth strip covering his eyes and glanced at Tianjin Rice. Are you okay? I'm a little heavy. Su Fan smiled. Impossible. Su Fan, when did you become so powerful? Tianjin Fan was stunned. Is this Su Fan still the guy who was easily abused by himself at the world's first martial arts conference? Give Tianjin Rice the feeling, how come this guy's strength has surpassed himself a lot? This is the result of hard work. Su Fan smiled slightly. By the way, before this, Su Fan had been to the Room of Spirit and time to cultivate for more than two months. Mr. Bobo said to Clint and the others. A Room of Spirit and Time. What is it? Clint hasn't heard of it. Cultivating there for a year is just equivalent to a day outside. Mr. Bobo explained. No wonder. That's how it is. Clint suddenly realized, Haha, Su Fan, you are really smart enough. Quote. Su Fan smiled. Immediately afterwards, Su Fan clearly saw that his reputation value actually changed from 2 to 3. Is it because he defeated Tianjin Rice that his reputation changed? Yes, it must be. If you want to upgrade to 3G speed, you need 10 reputation points, so if you work harder, you can increase the download speed. However, defeating Raditz and Tianjin Rice has earned a total of 3 reputation points, it seems that this reputation value is not so easy to earn, right? No way. No matter what, Su Fan decided that he had to increase his reputation as soon as possible. You can also increase the network speed to 3G first. The speed of 2G, Su Fan is really enough. Download anything at random and it will take at least an hour. Too slow. As long as you cultivate well, you will definitely surpass me. Su Fan said to Tianjin Fan, Clin and the others. I didn't expect the temple to have such a magical place. Clint was pleasantly surprised, I finally know why Goku is so powerful. Quote. Mr. Bobo, can we go in and cultivate? Tianjin Fan hurriedly asked. Of course, no problem. Mr. Bobo did not object, but the environment is very bad, and I am afraid that ordinary people will not last long. Since even Su Fan can hold on, we are not afraid. Clint said. You can only enter two people at a time, so you can team up by yourself. Mr. Bobo said. Of course, it's me and the dumplings in a group. Tianjin Rice is a matter of course. Me and Su Fan. Clint smiled. I refuse. Su Fan shook his head. What? You refuse? Why? Clint was stunned and asked puzzled. I've already raised my strength to the extreme, even if I cultivate no matter how I cultivate, I can't improve much in a short time, if you want to go, you guys go, I won't participate. Su Fan smiled. Do you mean that your strength is far beyond ours? Tianjin Fan clenched his fists and asked. 
Isn't the battle just now obvious? Su Fan asked with a smile. Tianjin Rice felt heartbroken. In this way, in order to make you cultivate harder, I will challenge all of you before you enter. Su Fan said with a smile to Tianjin Fan and the others. What? Tianjin Fan and Klin were both taken aback. Su Fan, you are really arrogant enough. Tianjin Rice, how is it? Do you want to join forces? Klin looked at Tianjin Rice. Of course, I don't want him to underestimate it. Tianjin Fan nodded, you don't want to either, right? Quote. I don't want to fight. Archie Loeb sat on the ground, looking innocent. Let's go together. Su Fan beckoned to the three people of Tianjin Rice, Klin and Dumplings. Suddenly, the three of them divided into three different directions and rushed towards Su Fan's side. Bang bang. With three muffled sounds, the three of them didn't know how Su Fan attacked, and they flew out upside down at that time and fell heavily to the ground. When the three got up from the ground, their faces were full of shock. This gap is not a little bit. And after defeating the trio, Su Fan found that his reputation value increased by two points. Now Su Fan's total reputation has reached five points. Okay, you guys play, I'm going home. Su Fan said, slowly rising into the sky. Go home. Su Fan, where are you going? Klin hurriedly asked. It's just that after Klin asked this sentence, he directly shut up. Didn't Su Fan say that he was going home? No, I mean asking, you went home and didn't practice. A year later, two more powerful Saiyans will appear, that's what you said. Klin said. For me, it doesn't mean much to stay here and cultivate. Su Fan smiled, it's not that I'm not cultivating, but I want to change the environment. Quote. But by cultivating in the room of spirit and time, we can get more time. Klin said. That kind of environment, when you go in, you will know. Su Fan said lightly. Klin, don't you understand? He meant that we dragged him back. Tianjin Fan said with a smile. Yes, Tianjin Rice is right. Su Fan nodded. Subsequently, Su Fan no longer paid attention to the three, but fell beside the heavenly god. Su Fan, you are right to do this, if you stay, there will indeed be no higher progress, it is better to cultivate in your own way. The heavenly god said to Su Fan with a solemn expression, I hope you work hard, you must protect the earth. Quote. Goodbye. Su Fan waved to the heavenly god, and then waved goodbye to Mr. Bobo and Klin and the others in the distance. Phew. Su Fan turned into a white glow and flew quickly in the direction where Bulma's home was. After Su Fan left, the three people of Klin, Dumpling, and Tianjin Rice were silent for a long time. Immediately afterwards, the three of them seemed to have beaten chicken blood and began to practice hard. After all, letting Su Fan surpass them so much, they were a little unbalanced in their hearts. You know, in the past, Su Vanna was the bottom of the three of them. Oh, it's a little higher than dumplings, but it doesn't necessarily beat dumplings. Dumplings have more specific functions. Now it's good, Su Fan actually surpassed them, and surpassed many, many more. Only Archirobe sat cross-kneeled on the ground, watching coldly. HMPH, it's better to eat something delicious, why let me also cultivate? Akilobe felt aggrieved. The reason why Su Fan left the temple was because he had basically downloaded everything that could be downloaded. Originally, Su Fan still wanted to download a few skills of dumplings and Tianjin rice, but after thinking about it, he couldn't waste time on downloading skills. Tianjin Raya's Sun Fist, Four Elephant Boxing, and Dumplings, Mind Control Skills will be downloaded later. Moreover, the skill of the Sun Fist, Su Fan believes that it should not be difficult, as long as he ponders it himself, he should also be able to learn it. Su Fan had already considered that the best way to improve his combat effectiveness was to conduct gravity training. Su Fan was in the room of spirit and time, basically overcoming 10 times gravity. Now what Su Fan has to do is to overcome at least 100 times gravity. Su Fan knew that the Monkey King in the original book had overcome 100 times gravity in just 7 days on his way from Earth to Namek. Of course, Sun Wukong is a genius type, moreover, Sun Wukong had 6 immortal beans in his hand at that time, and he improved his combat effectiveness by being reborn on the verge of death. Su Fan didn't think he could overcome 100 times gravity so quickly. However, even if his talent is dull, Su Fan thinks that he should be able to overcome 100 times gravity in a month or two, right? 
An hour later. Ah. Uh, Su Fan landed at Bulma's house. Bulma, I'm back. Su Fan greeted. Bulma ran out of the room, looking Su Fan up and down, and couldn't help frowning. Su Fan, why did you come back so quickly? How are you doing? Bulma asked, I don't like deserters. Quote. Bulma, I would never be a deserter. Su Fan smiled, but he was not angry. Girls want their men to stand tall, and Bulma, who is the richest woman in the world, is naturally no exception. Since Su Fan had promised Bulma to take care of her for the rest of her life, he naturally had to fulfill his promise. You don't practice at the Heavenly God, what are you doing here? That being said, Bulma was still a little ambivalent. On the one hand, after six days, Bulma missed Su Fan a little. Bulma, on the other hand, hopes to see Su Fan, who survives, a year later. Bulma knew that a year later, the arrival of those two Saiyans would definitely be a battle of life and death. If Su Fan didn't cultivate well, his life would definitely be in danger at that time. Bulma, I thought of a new way of cultivation, I hope you can help me. Su Fan said. A new way of cultivation. What? Bulma was stunned for a moment and asked. Bulma, help me build. As soon as Su Fan said this, he saw Bulma's father, Dr. Bribes, riding a bicycle past him. Ah, uh, Su Fan is back. Will those two Saiyans really come in a year? Dr. Bribes propped himself on the ground with one foot and turned to Su Fan and said. Doctor, you came just in time, do me a favor. Su Fan nodded and said to Dr. Breves with a smile. Need me to do something. Dr. Breves held up his glasses and asked. I need a gravity training room. Su Fan said, telling Bulma and her father all her thoughts. Bulma and Dr. Breves looked at each other. This kind of cultivation method is really unheard of. Dr. Bribes mused, but Sufin, are you sure you want to do up to 300 times the gravity? 300 times gravity, your weight is 80 kilogram, 300 times gravity is 24 tons. The gravity system is not simply putting heavy objects on your body, all parts of your body will bear 24 tons of heavy pressure. Quote. 300x gravity is for later, and my goal is to overcome 100x gravity first. Su Fan said. 100 times gravity. That's equivalent to 8 tons of weight. Dr. Bribes looked at Su Fan in surprise. If you don't do this, how can you defeat those two Saiyans in a year? Su Fan smiled. Su Fan, you're not joking, are you? Bulma asked. How long will it take to do it? Su Fan asked. This, at least a month or so, right? Dr. Bribes thought for a moment and replied. That's hard work, Dr. Su Fan nodded. That evening, Su Fan downloaded, Bulma's high technology, again. Sure enough, after having Bulma's high tech, Su Fan found that his mind was flooded with many, many high tech research materials. Even, Su Fan had a certain understanding of the system of the gravity training room. Afterwards, Su Fan looked at Bulma's body to see if there was anything else to download. It is worth mentioning that Bulma's ultra technology did not appear. After downloading, Bulma's high technology, Bulma's body has no option to download. Over the next few days, Bulma and Dr. Breves began building the gravity cultivation room for Su Fan. Su Fan, help bring the wrench over. Bulma greeted Su Fan. Between couples, they already have a taste of each other physically, so there is nothing to be polite. Bulma this is for Su Fan in the creation of gravity training room, Su Fan is next to the hand, just to put the downloaded knowledge into practice. Dr. Bribes was outside setting up the entire training room. Su Fan handed the wrench to Bulma. This place, something isn't quite right. Bulma took the wrench, looked at the dashboard above, and fell into deep thought. I look normal. Su Fan looked in his eyes and asked. Bulma glanced up at Su Fan. After a short silence. The program of the gravity training room is almost designed, but I want to make it in a way that gravity can only take effect if it is incorporated into your genes. Bulma said. Integrate into my genes to work. Su Fan thought thoughtfully. Think about it, if you're doing 100x gravity training, if I accidentally come in, I'll be crushed to death. Bulma said with a solemn expression. So, you are right, it is true that only my own use is more appropriate. Su Fan nodded. Now I'm thinking about how to get the system to automatically recognize your genes. Bulma held her chin and muttered. Modify and modify the system code. Su Fan proposed. 
I thought about changing the system code, but the system code cannot be changed in a little bit, it takes a lot of time, and typing the code is a very boring thing. Bulma scratched her head and said with some distress, after changing it like this, after testing, several days have passed. Quote. Su Fan did not speak. Dad is busy building equipment outside, and the code of the system is written by me, I really don't want to write and change the code anymore. Bulma sighed, if only I had a doppelganger, let my doppelganger complete the code for me. Quote. Bulma was talking, but saw Su Fan sitting in front of the computer, skillfully typing code. Seeing the line of program instructions that Su Fan knocked down, Bulma's beautiful eyes almost jumped out of their eye sockets. Moreover, Bulma clearly found that the code that Su Fan had typed down was correct, just as he had envisioned. Su Fan, you you you, when did you learn to program? Bulma stuttered. I learned it a long time ago, and I used it for the first time today, so it's a little rusty. Su Fan typed two more lines of code and said without looking back. Bulma. Do you call this rusty? How fast you knock the program code without thinking, okay. You've also gone to learn programming with Pool before. It's unimaginable. Bulma was surprised. Pool didn't learn. Su Fan smiled and asked casually, by the way, Pool and Oolong went out to school for a trip and haven't come back yet. Quote. Soon, huh. This time their school went on a spring outing to a faraway place, and they had to go for 10 days. Bulma counted the time, I should be back tomorrow. Quote. The pool mentioned here is the flying cat that Leping used to have. However, after Su Fan woke up, Pool and Oolong both went out for a spring outing, so they were not present. Wait a minute, Su Fan, you have a bit of a problem with this code, shouldn't you write it like this? Bulma watched Su Fan typing the code in the back and said suddenly. Yes. Su Fan ignored it and continued to type down another line of code. Huh. Yes. Yes. Is it still possible to write like this? Bulma's small mouth opened slightly, and a look of shock appeared on her face. Bulma originally thought that Su Fan's line of code was problematic. It was only when Su Fan connected the next line of code that Bulma discovered how clever Su Fan's code was. Bulma, hurry up, continue at this pace, one month is enough to complete the gravity training room. At this time, Dr. Breves also happened to come in from outside, and saw Su Fan sitting at the computer desk typing on the keyboard, Bulma watching from behind, and thought that Bulma was grinding foreign workers. However, after Dr. Breves said this, he found that both of them ignored him. Dr. Breves couldn't help but walk up and crane his neck to look. At this look, Dr. Breves' glasses almost fell off. Su Fan, you you you, when did you learn to write programs? Dr. Breves was more surprised and surprised. I learned it a long time ago, I haven't used it much, but I didn't expect it to come in handy today. Su Fan turned back to Dr. Breves and nodded slightly. It's remarkable. Dr. Breves was somewhat impressed by Su Fan. Previously, Dr. Breves felt that this Su Fan was just a lazy person. The daughter followed him, and it was really a flower on cow dung. However, Dr. Breves is more liberal and does not say it explicitly. At least, Dr. Breves' previous opinion of Su Fan was that he didn't like it, even a little annoying. Now seeing the code written by Su Fan, of course, Dr. Breves could not have changed his attitude drastically all of a sudden, but it had changed a little. 20 minutes later. Okay, done. Su Fan clapped his hands and pressed the simulation run button. The system starts running. Nothing major problem. Yes, Su Fan, I didn't expect that the code you modified was actually the same as I thought, you won't be a roundworm in my stomach, right? Bulma smiled and looked at Su Fan in surprise. We've been together for so long, can I not know what you think? Su Fan smiled. Great. This is a lot easier. Bulma breathed a sigh of relief. The next day, Pool and Oolong returned from a school trip. Su Fan, after seeing Su Fan, Pool flew towards Su Fan and threw himself into Su Fan's arms. During this time of Pool's spring outing, Bulma and Pool also told Pool some things by phone. Therefore, Pool directly called Su Fan's real name. How's Pool? Are you happy going out this time? Su Fan smiled and touched Pool's head. Then, in Su Fan's sea of knowledge, two options for Pool that could be downloaded appeared. Transfiguration. 80M. Flight. 90M. No gas required. These two downloadable options look pretty good. 
Su Fan decided to download them all. However, it is not the time to download now, wait until you have the opportunity. The most important thing now is to quickly build the gravity training room. Then, Su Fan had to find a way to earn a little prestige value. Now Su Fan's total reputation value is 5, which is pitiful. To upgrade to a 3G network, you need at least 10 reputation points. Only, how do you get more prestige? That night, Su Fan was in the darkest corner of the city and eliminated a gang that committed the crime. However, what puzzled Su Fan was that his reputation had not increased a little because of the elimination of this gang. Prestige prestige. Su Fan muttered in a low voice, is it because he is not famous yet? If you change to Mr. Satan, shouldn't it be easy to accumulate prestige? Thinking like this, Su Fan took advantage of Bulma and Dr. Bribes in the process of building a gravity training room to fight a world boxing championship, and easily won the first place. It's just that what makes Su Fan a little strange is that his reputation value has not changed because of this, and it is still 5. Su Fan frowned. On the way home, Su Fan heard someone shouting, help, on the ground not far ahead. Su Fan immediately turned on the, God's watch, and looked into the distance. At a glance, Su Fan saw a huge Tyrannosaurus Rex, and in front of the Tyrannosaurus Rex, there was a child running at a rapid speed, shouting, help, while running. Isn't this Sun Gohan? Sun Gohan and Vic cultivating here. However, Su Fan let go of the induction, but found that Vic was actually thousands of miles away, which was far away from here. Moreover, looking at what Sun Gohan was wearing, it was still the same as before, and there was no change. It is said that according to the development of the plot, the current monkey rice should be dressed in the costume of the monkey king, and there will be a conspicuous, demon, engraved on the back of the clothes. At the same time, Sun Gohan will have a short sword in his hand for self-defense. All this, no. Su Fan thought about it, fell from the sky, and slapped the large Tyrannosaurus Rex unconscious. Huh. Yes yes yes, is it Uncle Su Fan? Sun Wuhan was stunned for a moment, and after seeing Su Fan's appearance clearly, he was suddenly surprised and delighted. Su Fan smiled at Sun Wuhan. Hmm, Uncle Su Fan, I want to go home, I want to go home. Woohoo, Sun Wuhan threw himself into Su Fan's arms at that time, crying bitterly. Su Fan had nothing to comfort Sun Wuhan, so he made him cry for a while. Uncle Su Fan, I'm looking for my mother, I'm looking for my father. Sun Gohan sobbed. Gohan, your father died in the battle with the Saiyans, you have to believe in your abilities, follow Vic to cultivate well, and in a year, you will see your father. Su Fan said positively. Sun Gohan stopped crying and looked at Su Fan with a pout, looking very aggrieved. Gohan, uncle can take you back to your mother. Su Fan said, but in a year, if those two Saiyans come, you may not be able to help your father. Quote. I, can I help my dad? Sun Gohan was stunned and asked rhetorically. Don't you want to fight alongside your dad? Su Fan smiled and asked. I, I think, Sun Gohan nodded. In that case, you have to cultivate well. You are also a Saiyan, you are a fighting nation, the most powerful warrior in the entire universe. Su Fan patted Sun Gohan's head. Well, I know, I must work hard. Sun Gohan nodded bravely. Thanks for watching, please subscribe and support our channel.